Lovely YouTube people, welcome back. I'm still slightly under the weather, but I'm feeling significantly better um, and should sound at least significantly better. So thank you guys so much for being patient, all of yours. This is about your precious borders gate. I care about our lives, our futures. No, you just care about your stupid apprenticeship. Okay, well, where we left off, we're obviously in the middle of someone's drama. I don't know who, I don't know whose drama. I don't know, frankly, what's going on. I think we had just come back to the tiefling camp, which is called the hollow. And we have a lot to do quest wise. So we met up with, um, we, we got withers. So that was good. Cause we actually didn't finish that from our first streaming session. And now I think we're trying to do, I think I wanted to save Arabella. I think I was trying to go in like a reverse order i guess find arabella's parents maybe let's focus on this but then there's lots of people that we can talk to so let's maybe do that as well oh my god everyone typing backwards you can't and thank that you all for matter. the follows of course it does you would choose strangers over us all right what's all this hubbub Pearls. we can't just leave the kin i'll not gamble our lives our futures on people who are as good as dead we must leave for Baldur's gate at once can we all just take a moment, please? Please, yes, please. What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Oi. It's a lot of hubbub going on there. Let's see. We can either do persuasion. You should all stay. A single blade could make a difference, which is true. But we do also have a tiefling response. Have you forgotten... El Churel, we should stand by our people or no one else will. Do I like that or no one else will? Um, Cause I don't know, is that like breeding, you know, a kind of, I, am, I, am I perpetuating the idea that the tiefling are alone and that there's no one else that cares about them? I don't know if I believe that. But it does seem like a compelling option and I won't risk failing this one. So let's start out with a win, I think, early on. This isn't El Terrell, and El I'm Terrell. not responsible for every damn tiefling in the world. Just be responsible for yourself then. We have to stay. It's the right thing to do. Zerg. Fine. We'll stay. If we survive, it'll make for a good story, I suppose. Thank you, Roland. Okay. Well, they're gonna stay at least. I'd die if I met Laroa can reeking of this place. I'll never get the smell out of my clothes. Okay. Um, so let's see. Should we talk to you? Again. I don't know how much I want to save after talking to these people. I have something to ask. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. Okay. Not forever. This is no fortress and we're no warriors. Da and we've spoken to all the ox yes, uh, last time that we streamed. <laughs> he stares right past you as if you're invisible or boring. Not the all boring chat. We just started. Snobido, hey, Outlaw, hi. How's it going, lovely? Um, Are you all right? No, maybe we'll, I'm not going to turn around and see what he's looking at. We'll go, are you right? <laughs> All right. Anything on your mind? Mm. He's still staring right past you. All right, I'll bite. You see nothing out of the ordinary. He's going to pick pocket me. back, the child slips between the rocks. Hmm. Right where Raggy. All right, I need at least an 11. Oh, there we go. Starting off strong. Let's hope we're not using all my luck on something that's probably fairly you inconsequential. Find the edges of a concealed entrance. Um, all right, what well, can we, can, concealed entrance, let's go. I know, my characters are always stupid. I hate it. Newt, hi. 
do default quick save limits is 25 does it then just scrub over whatever your earliest quick save is or does it go like you can't quick save anymore uh, what else is going on here all right well let's go talk to you again Well, look who's come to visit. <gasps> I want something My like this. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. You saved Arabella from the druids. Don't know what those bastards would have done. And thanks for going easy on Sylphie. Not many marks would have done the same. Would you be mad if on my next playthrough made my guardian into your character's image? Oh, thank you, Outlaw. That'd be awesome. I would be honoured. I'd be absolutely honoured. I am a... Oh, no, you don't get to pick what class your companion is, right? Thank you. Also, max it to 50. Hard save should be permanent, though. Okay, Glitchly, hi, hero. Hey. Take over Starion and steal it. What do you mean? Shush. Okay, thanks for going easy and Sylvie. Not many marks would have done the same. Why are you running all these schemes and swindles? Risky, you know. You better keep these kids in check. They won't get off so lightly forever. Why are you running all these schemes? It is risky. We're saving up for a better hideout when we get to Baldur's Gate. Okay. Why? You planning on telling me stealing is wrong? Stealing is wrong. Yes, you're taking advantage of it during bad times. There are words for fault. There are words for folks like that. Quite the opposite. I want to invest in the newest thieves guild. Oh no. Oh no. Um, <clears throat> I'm also not their mother. Oh God. Cause then also, okay. Not, uh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, Asterion is also listening. Not that you should try and do things to impress other people. However, comma. Um, all right. <clears throat> I don't think... Okay, okay. I don't think I should be funding this. There's surely... We shouldn't be having... Encourage bad behavior. Minus one intelligence. After all, stop that. I can't help it that my character's not cracked open a book. You should absolutely keep that in mind. Let the chaos reign, I know. Um... Mm. Oh, you know what? I, yeah, play according to my alignment. What do I think? We do have... Okay, I actually, I have the opportunity to start a community poll. So I just started the poll. I don't know how long the poll runs for, but you guys can vote using my extension, I believe. Let's get some votes in. Let's see. I, I may or may not choose what chat wants, but it's fun to get your guys' votes in. My alignment is, like, always the same with these sorts of things. Where, like, my, my heart's always in the right place. But sometimes, you know, that doesn't always mean picking the obviously, obviously right answer. I, I... I sometimes, I want to try and do as good as possible. But sometimes I just work myself in tricky situations. You know? Does that answer your question? <laughs> you can change companion and character classes. The only thing you can't change is race background. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done, chat. I don't know. Wait, how do I know when the poll is over, by the way? In 23 years, Mole would be a guild boss, I hope. Yeah, maybe, Jake. Welcome in. A little harmless fun option sometimes. Yeah, this this is like a harmless thing. This one's harmless. Um, Because like also, if you think about it, they might be stealing from the bad guys. And then therefore, like Robin Hood was a good person who did bad things, but it was good, you know? You weren't a bad guy though. I'm not a bad guy. I think I'm gonna do this. I think I'm gonna go, I think I'm gonna go. I'm not your mother, do as you please. Oh yeah, they're benefiting the tiefling community. Mm. 
No, I'll go with- I'll go- No, we're go- <laughs> What- yes, that's what you voted. What's- what you voted. Don't trust us. You don't trust us. Cool. Of course I don't trust you guys. It's so important watching folks figure out how they want to play the role play in the game. I know, I'm like trying to feel out how my character's feeling. Because she's not like your straight edge. Does it, just because you're a bad guy doesn't mean you're a bad guy. Yeah. Stealing from the rich is not wrong. See, we, like, we don't know who they're stealing from. Okay, okay, this is the thing, right? They live on hard times. I don't know if I should be investing and then doing something overtly bad. If you give them money, maybe they won't have to steal as much. We'll go with what chat voted. We'll do it, we'll do it. Won't turn down free money. I've got operating costs you wouldn't believe. Come see me in the city sometime, huh? I'll repay this and then some. See you around, maybe. Okay, but did Asterion approve? No one! I didn't get any approval or disapproval, but we do have friends now. All right, all right. Save the game, you save. Boombosh sorted. Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome in. Um, all right. Say so, da, 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 da. Do we speak to them? No. Who did we? Who? Did I... Frankly, I want to. I just want the little gold horn thing. You don't look so tough. Mole thought of a hobgoblin all by herself. It needs to be so bloody rude. I've not had a chance to fight a hobgoblin. Or I did. I fought many goblins. Oh. Hello again. Um, Mole's in charge here, not me. What a little angel. What a little baby. Little baby. Thanks for the follows, guys. Does the magic able to prove? Oh, gosh. Existential crisis. Magic Eight Ball, do you approve of uh, funding a thieving ring of children? Children thieving ring, do you approve? Don't count on it. Oh God. <gasps> Standing mirror. Well, I'm not gonna steal the mirror from the children. Better not be cursed. The book, of course, I'll take, cause they're not gonna read it. There were once two sisters, one a great fighter and one a great cleric, who longed for adventure. I shall skew an elder brain upon my now. sword, cried the fighter, to the underdark. I wish to know the secrets of the brains' power, said the cleric. Let us be off. In the recesses of the deep, the sisters slew darklings and darrow, bugbears and bullets. The two reached an illithid colony, where the fourth ten day passed. Their quest would soon be complete. With great effort, they felled a half dozen mind flayers and soon reached the Elder Brain's lair. It rose from the brine pool at the center of its chamber, flanked by illithids. The brain didn't me. speak aloud, but the sisters could hear it in their minds. I am called Quasod. Why have you come? I will make your powers my own, called the cleric. I will crush you and bring an end to your tyranny, said the fighter. The brain hovered in silence. A moment later, a burst of psionic energy shook the chamber, and the sisters lay dead. Good luck, Quaoz replied. The Illithids feasted heartily that day. Good lord. That's horrible, isn't it? What's up this way? This is, I don't feel like there's anything else here. We spoke, yeah, I spoke to Melly. We spoke to Mole, yeah. That was who we paid. I had a feeling you'd be back. I just want the gold on your horn. No, 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 leave. You've been a friend to us. Come back anytime. Got it. You befriended a bunch of kids, but you don't know what the kids are going to grow up to be. Ch children are the future. I think it's a good thing I befriended a bunch of kids. I need new pockets. I wonder if the gods are watching me. Mm. Um. Oh. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Hey. 
You don't know. You've not given it a crack. Well, how the hell do I get out the hideout? If not through the hole? Oh, oh cancel, cancel. I still have to get used to the, the camera and all that, guys. Sorry. I can trade with Mole. What do, I don't know if I want to trade. I don't know what I want to trade. Where's Oh no, that's Zaki, sorry. Silphy. Give Mole a 10 day and she'll own Boulder's Gate. You'll see. You can lay the apology video when? What do I have to apologize for? Nothing. Where is Mole? Gods, it's boring in here. Thieves is sta Imagine if I stole their stash. I mean Come on. Unhinged. I had a feeling you'd be back. Who is that, CM? Who's Fagan? Is Vots here? The home key on keyboard aligns the camera to point north. Helps navigate with the map. Oh, thank you. Um, do you have anything to trade? Okay, so she's got gold. Elixir of hill giant strength. Poison resistant scroll of torching ray. Sun melon piece. A stuffed bear. A pear. Thieves tools, that might be handy. Maybe I'll take the thieves tools. <laughs> what do you, how do I, how do I? <laughs> okay, wait, I put like this here and then, um, how, what, it, what is she, how do I know what she wants? How do I know what the going rate is for this stuff? Oh, Oliver Twist reference. Sorry, I've not read Oliver Twist. Sorry. Click the weight scale above barter, then put your value. All right. Okay. Oh, I could have traded maybe. Hmm. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, we're learning. Anything else? No, thank you. You've been a friend to us. Come back anytime. Um. Yes, coming. Uh, how how do I leave this place from up here? Maybe. Yeah, there's a ladder. Great. Add their wares, then add what you want to give up gold. Click scale to ensure it's a fair trade. Okay, so I could have offered something else and then maybe it would have given them like, yes, I'll accept. No, I won't. I'm still so early on that I'm not even like that. How do I say? I mean, to be fair, I am also hoarding a bunch of, a uh, bunch of things. Find Arabella's parents down below but I think it's around this area oh here we go here they're, they're right here they're right here so then hang on can I just save hey lap dance how's it going a job of loot goblin in games I think so. I would say so you ever scare me like that again and I'll feed you to a null mom I'm fine. Stop it. I mean, but you're not- Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. Um, hope we'll meet again under better circumstances. I saved your daughter. Got anything more than a thanks for me. This could have ended badly. Keep her in line from now on. No more light-fingered antics, right, Arabella? I mean, I did just fund a thieving ring. So it does feel um, hypocritical to say no more light fingered antics. Uh, but I'm also not so crude to say I've saved your daughter. Got anything more than a thanks for me. Um, this could have ended badly. Keep her in line from now on. It's also presumptuous. Like, I'm not a parent. How am I? Well, I'm not going to tell them how to parent. I'll say I hope we'll meet again under best circumstances. It seems like the best option available. Likewise. Arabella? Thank you. For helping me. 
Reward. Arabella is safe. Her parents are grateful for your intervention. I received... Your mother was a heartbeat away from fighting a bear. Uh, Kumira's locket. Grants the wearer the ability to cast dancing lights. Gale can absorb this item's magic, destroying it. Hmm. But I've got a better necklace currently equipped. All right. But the thing is, like, would I want to give that to Gale, do we think? Ugh. I'm never going to hear the end of this. If I'd got that stupid idol, I'd be a hero. What kind of hero did you expect to be? What kind of hero did you expect to be? <sighs> Gorgeous. A heroic thief? Mum? Dad, Mole? They all would have been so impressed. Mole said we had to do something because the old folks weren't doing anything. They were talking when the druids were getting ready to throw us out. Why can't we just stay in until it's safe? Okay. Stealing the idol. Don't do things to impress people, right, Asteria? <laughs> Uh, not that. Uh, that. Okay, so let's do the last thing in the Druid's Grove right now. Save the refugees. It's not the best item you find, so yeah, feed it to Gale. Do I give it to Gale as a necklace or like give it to him to literally feed? Like to, to like crack open or whatever. You can also sell items for less than what they're worth to increase the buyer's affinity to me. Ah, good lord. Okay. I mean, I, I feel like I'm still super early on, right? Or not? Like surely this is still really early. Uh... Ah, my good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Okay, ask your questions. And there's no overstating my disinterest. I've got no, 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 no. Go ahead, ask your questions. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Um, size, nature, distinguishing qualities? You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Um, well, I have the option to give an exact description. Common variety of goblins. Well, no, if I, if, let's give the exact description, go on, in for a penny, in for a pound. Goblins were of a rare jam-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. Is that true? Weaver, this man has no respect for truth. Oh. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? I think there's uh, I think there's a bit of misunderstanding. What do you want exactly? He's obviously let him add his flair to it, Lazel. Chill. Hey bots, how's it going? Super early, yeah. Okay, cool. Follow just follow this guy. Expert optometrist. Hang on, hey, there's a bit of misunderstanding. What do you want exactly? The truth, my friend. Not a jot more or less. Alright, then we'll Last tell the question, truth. Then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Um, the truth is, I don't think so. I was frankly concentrating on not dying. And you can embellish however you want, mate. Really? Well, this does complicate things. But then again, well, never mind. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Never you mind. I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. 
I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. <laughs> what brought you to the world in the first... We need to pivot away from this. What brought you to the world in the first place? Let's try and rally this back in. Also, I've just noticed poor Shadowheart is back at camp without her camp comfy clothes because I've stolen them. But he's, they've got these like cutouts right by the hips. It is a very cool outfit. Why, goblins, obviously. But well, someone ought to chronicle these curious events. I'd heard the master of this place, a druid called Halson, might be able to point me in the right direction. Okay. But he's been quite captured by them already. Ironic, really. Ah, uh, because it's a top and pants. I think that's what the slit is. It's like a bustier top. Got it. Um, Why the dragon? About our conversation earlier, why the dragon? No, be careful. Goblins aren't known for mercy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? And an invisibility potion stashed potion? in your back pocket. All right. Until we meet again. Fare thee well. I bid you adieu. Okay, cool. Ah, my grizzled friend. Um, let's go speak to place. whomever I need to speak to. I think it's this person. Nope, not that one. Defendenos ab iminentibus equilibrio tuo. That ritual, common gross spell, but altered somehow. Is this who I need to speak to? Not just altered, but magnified. Ajene kulamor en umbra tua pate arborum. Okay. Um. So they're like properly in the thick of whatever they're doing. Um. Can I get you to interrupt what you're doing somehow? Can I join you? I mean, what happens? Can I like walk in the middle of this? <laughs> Will you be disturbed? Oh no! What's happening? Uh, oh no, I need to go lower down. I need to go lower down. Uh, okay. This way, this way. Sorry. Well, now now I'm just right in the middle of your blessing when I don't... Need something? I didn't mean to click on him. Uh, I don't know if I want to talk to you well, well, with everyone else watching me right now. We'll just hang on. I'm not ready to get hot under the collar just yet. Out, 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 out. Okay, we need to go. Where's the entrance? To get lower down. <gasps> we can talk to the bird. Oh, oh, uh, uh. Of course. No, 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 Topaz, come back. Shh, I'm concentrating. This look good? Is the coin in the middle? <laughs> Why? Um, a deception or intimidation? I'm not going to do either to the poor bird. Come on. The lovely Scottish bird. That seems foul. I finished about 1% of it. Yes, yeah, so I'm pretty early on so far. Um, it's slightly off. Push it a bit to the right. But thing is, I guess that. Yes. Yes, you're right. That's it. Yes, of course. Uh, well, not really. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang, hang on. What if? What? If, hang on. Yes. Yes. This is perfect. Damn. Not a lot of options to interact with the bird. Beautiful Larue, thank you for the like. Hi, you lovely, and thank you guys so much for the follows. Welcome in. Um, here? No, that's not a door. I need to get lower down. Where is? 
Where is the entrance to get lower down? This way? No, that was to get through here. Phantom, hey! Kick the bird is crazy. That's wild. I know there are people playing like evil playthroughs, but I I want to know the percentage of people that choose to kick the bird. On this Toffet! The bear is sleeping. We won't disturb it whilst it sleeps. Damn, is this really not the door to get in there? Seems so foul, huh? Don't be stealing the statue unless you're looking for a mad fight. I was just trying to get their attention. There's a character that can teach me how to play an instrument. Oh, all right. So now, hang on. Help the refugees, I think is in here. Right? Yeah, okay, okay. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? No. Only a monster would threaten a child. You're protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. Honestly, I just want to see what would happen. <sighs> Roland, hey. Danny, welcome in. Um, okay, do I think she's a monster? No, but also you shouldn't be threatening children like that. You're protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. I don't know if I agree with that either. But I don't just want to see what would happen. This sucks. I feel like there's no answer that I want. Um. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm going to say you're protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. Because I am a druid and a tiefling. So I feel like if I side too much with the tieflings, maybe she won't trust me. First, you urge grace. Then you speak truth. To think a devil could surprise me twice over. A shame the grace period ends. The viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. Mm -hmm. No matter. Mm -hmm. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Okay, okay, wow, wow, wow. We have a lot more options now. Gatorade, welcome in. Why, why, why that face? I think she's a monster. Yeah, yeah, but we're, we're trying to, we're like playing the field a little bit. We can't go full, we're both tiefling and druid. We're torn, we're trying to win her over. Okay, so druids, is this a right, is this right druidic? I've never witnessed such magic. What does forcing them out achieve? They've done nothing. You cast out you cast out the guiltless you shame your order you cast out the guiltless you got yeah, there's usually more nuanced yeah answers offered like right now it seems d town welcome in hi so wait am i correct in thinking number four you cast out the guiltless means that, that's me, like, siding with the child a little bit. Like, shame on you. Guiltless, aka innocent, right? I think I'm gonna do this one. A disease of the flower must not reach the root. Pluck the petals, sever the branch if you must. But cut out the rot before it infects the whole of the wood. Teachings of the Tree Father. Do you agree? No. Words you have twisted to justify your cruelty. Mm. I know the Tree Father's teachings as well as you. Maybe like this. I know. I know. <laughs> we're trying to. We're like. Game recognizes game. A little bit. Christ, welcome in. How's it going? Crazy. If they sealed off the grove, there wouldn't be much. Genetic variation for future. Maybe okay. Let's let's go like this. 
Then you know I heed his wisdom. I protect the circle, whatever the cost. Nah, hang on, not whatever you the cost. You great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to the tiefling leader. Zevlor, he's called. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander Rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. I don't know how I feel about this. I might have whiffed this one, guys. I don't know. Hey, um, Sun uh, Beedlery, thank you for- Oh, no, no, no. Sunstreak, thank you for the hydrate. Game recognizes the headache. Hey, Herman. Watching you make all of the choices is going to be too much fun. That's my- that's my hope. Again, you're kind of getting glimpses into, um, what my- I was gonna say thought patterns like I just managed to do this to myself a lot you did well to speak up for the girl that snake is fickle mm -hmm. a tragedy prevents exactly that cargo seems dangerous and if I hadn't spoken up what would happen now let me say that cargo seems dangerous well seen well spotted we've let a snake replace our leader how did cargo take Kaga seems happy to rule the roost. Who's your real leader? How did Kaga take over the whole grove? Let's do this. She is first druid in Halcyon's absence. With him caught or dared by goblins, none may gainsay. But more will die if her ritual is finished. I doubt those exiled by the right will survive long outside. If no one's looking for Halcyon, I could do it. Would you? Yeah. I would give anything to see Halcyn return home. I'd like more soul other than anything. No, 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 Fred, I'll find him. Sylvanas's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Halcyn is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Okay. Come, boy. It's all right. It's all right. Viewing NPCs through the lens of spoilers makes them hard to talk about, but Kaga is clearly evil, I think, at this point. Yes, I mean, Kaga is not a particularly pleasant person. Uh, and they've made that quite clear. Union Plark? Can I read her or am I too stupid? Darkest hour, a concord made, twixt harp and wild against the shade. Local history, written in riddles. The towers seized, the battle done. The moonrise broke the so darkest pretty. one. You recognize the mark of the dark goddess Shah on the broken helmet. This army marched in her name. Moonrise must be a reference to Shah's divine sister, Saluna. It's so pretty. It's so pretty, isn't it? I mean, goodness. With the way the water's reflecting on it, and it's like perfectly weathered in a way. I don't know. I, I just think it's really lovely to look at. And this is going to be the rest of the playthrough, guys. Um, all right. Obviously, more people to talk to. Let's talk to more people here. What will you people want next? Letting the hell child go was a mistake. Hey, you watch your mouth. The hell Please child. leave. Our hospitality has limits, and they were crossed long ago. Okay, but now here's the thing that I want to know. Are they being this rude to me because I'm a tiefling? Because lest we forget, I'm also a druid. And I didn't... I didn't have, when I made my character, I didn't at first know, obviously, that the conflict or like the tension between the two 
that it, or that it's as the tension's as severe as it is. But I actually do find it really interesting. I'm glad that I picked roles that wouldn't necessarily go together. I feel like it makes for really interesting like conundrums so early on. This game is so gorgeous, Ash. Right, it's stunning, and I'm so early on. I'm so I know I'm so I early see on. You. Just give me a moment. Is there anything I can do to help? A moment. This medicality. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now. What was it you needed? I just wanted to help the bird, to be honest. Um. Healing. Looks like I came to the right person. I do what I can. For most folks, that's enough. Come here. Let's have a look at you. Yeah, so I've got this parasite behind my eye. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Oh, tadpole. Uh... <laughs> so good way of putting this. I have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? <clears throat> a mind flare tadpole? Uh... I feel like I've made a mistake. I... Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. <clears throat> okay. Hang on, weren't we... need we to be quick. Weren't we supposed this to way. go to the crash? Oh my god, Gatorade. Unfortunately, not This teaching. one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. At least I knew to mute that time. Am I a druid of this grove? I... Maybe not of this grove. I don't know. I guess there are different. I am a druid of the moon. But even if I was a druid of the land, I don't know if I'd still be a druid of this grove. I don't know exactly how it works. Yes, Kang Furball. I would say the crush is later game. Oh, okay, okay. I think it was marked as my most recent, like, main main quest or something. But anyway. Tadpole crawled out of his head. Uh, the drow and I have the same kind of parasite. I'm hoping for a less grave cure. So you killed him and laid him on the table. Is everyone being captured by mind flayers these days? I do think this is a common experience. Um. Yeah, I guess let's try this one. Such good music as well. Rather too common as of late. At least that's what Master Halson suspected. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. Well, how you don't have to be here for this. Hang on, hang I'm on. I'm interested in the procedure, actually. Please, go ahead. What? All right. Oh, no. Let's see what we can do. Well, how good are you? I'm not convinced you know how to do it, because the other one's dead on the table. Um, what was the plan? Will it help? It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? Um... Looking closer, you recognize the branch. And it's no druidic cure. She's holding Kalimvor's kiss. A briar from the Dale lands. And a deadly poison. She's trying to kill me. Um... What is this? I came to you for help. Put the bride down and we'll talk. Try to poison me and you'll regret it. This was a mistake. I should go. Um, what is this? I came to you for help. Let's have a little bit of drama. I want to help you. But I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? Well, I don't know how much I trust her. I, can, I don't trust you. I'm leaving. That's going to cause some drama. 
I fell from a so I can merge my mind with anyone else that's infected, which is true. I fell from a ship in the sky, but something caught me. It saved my life. Okay. An intellect devourer spoke to me as if I were one of its own. No, nothing strange. I just want it out of my head. Um. Oh no. Because this is the thing, right? We know she's got the poison thingy. So I don't think I trust her and I should leave. But me saying, I don't trust you, I'm leaving, is automatically going to kick off drama. Is my problem. And I know it's going to kick off drama. Um, I feel like none of these options are good. No, no, I should do this one. I'm not going to pull this one because I feel like this is an important one. And I don't want to leave it up to chat. She, okay, I have a fair reason to not trust her because she is holding something to try and kill me. But I feel like if I... Do you know why you're infected? Like, what is the purpose? I've got no idea, Ash. I don't know if I'm supposed to know by now. I think probably not. Um, but I've got no idea. Okay, thank you so much for the get well soon. And how is Puyas doing the hype challenge as well? How's Puyas' hype challenge going? The good news is that there are trillions of story paths. Yeah, I know, right? No one playthrough is the same. No two playthroughs are the same, rather. Um, all right. Okay, okay, this is this is this is how I've reasoned it out guys. Okay, stay with me I'm not sure whether or not I can trust her. Okay But I know if I say I don't trust you we're gonna kick off drama Okay, so I don't want to go with number five I don't want to tell her number one because I don't that's 100% accurate and I don't know if I can trust her with number one So I think I'm gonna do number two I fell from the sky, but something caught me. It saved my life. That could be fine, right? You can quick save, yeah, in conversations. Thank you, thank you. Let's do that. Protected from on high. Sounds like the drow. Master Halson said he was tougher than he had any right to be. How'd you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. Put the thorns down, and I'll tell ya. I'm trying to help you, but I need to be sure. Put it so down. Where'd you get that thing? Oh my word. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave the conversation. Um. We're here for the drop. I'll go. I'll play. Stu I, I am stupid. I'll play stupid. I don't know. I just woke up with it. I don't know. To hell's with it. Ah! Oh, no, no, no. Uh, okay. I have a plus two dexterity. And a plus one. Uh, okay, we're going to go for the dexterity. We need a horror monitor for the game. Genuinely. I'm so okay, okay, we have to do the okay, we're gonna go for the dodge. Okay, okay. I just need I just need an eight or above. I just need an eight or above, guys. Jellyfish, get your ass back here. This is such an interesting way of viewing the situation. Ah oh, no, 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 no. I can roll it again. Okay. Please, 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 please. I just need, I just need an eight or above. No! <laughs> no! I think she's gonna kill me. I think she's gonna kill me. You try to dodge her blow, but she catches you, scratching your hand. There. It's done. I'm truly, truly sorry. For what it's worth, 
The poison is painless. It'll be like going to sleep. Ah! Oh. You can't have it. I can't risk you turning. You'd kill us all. Ah! Oh. Oh. Oh, no! Tito, thank you so much for continuing your gifted sub, you legend. Probably have depression, rip. Welcome in chat. Best I can do is a seven. You guys are cruel. Give me the goddamn antidote. I won't. I can't. You must. Okay, 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 guys. But I don't have symptoms. I'm not changing. That's true. And we've got the plus two from wisdom. Or we could do the druid history option. Try to recall the tenets of our order. No druid could support this. <gasps> my god, I've got the minus two for intelligence. Minus two? But I get the advantage because I'm a druid. So I get two dice roll. Okay. Mm or deception, which we're not going to do deception. Maybe we do, maybe we gamble a bit and we do the advantage. I think so. Let's try it, guys. Thank you for the follows, everyone. Welcome in. And we are a druid. <gasps> oh my god, guys. I need to roll a 17. I need one of these to be a 17. Bro. Yes. Gods above. It's a risk, but maybe you deserve a chance. I think hell, guys. All right. Master Halson did say the drow's tadpole was dormant. Maybe yours is too. Now this is a vial of wyvern poison. It's quick and painless. Swear to me you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. I hope it doesn't come to that. But thank you. Here. And here's the antidote. Do not mix those two up. I spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Oh, and no, wait, wait, of you. wait. Maybe more. Oh, no, it's the antidote. That's the antidote. It's the antidote. Studying. Trying Sorry. to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flares out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Guys, I'm so bummed. I went through and I got poisoned and I saved myself only for at the end to have Asterion disapprove. And I panicked because I thought I drank the poison. I'm sorry, I thought I drank the poison. God damn it, Asterion, you don't understand. I was on the brink of death. I was seeing beyond the, you know, the pearly gates at that point. Leave me alone. Um, you, you must have learned something from studying them, surely. For one, that thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from Mind Flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Then why the hell were you going to kill me, you dozy cow? Hard to say. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Do you think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. 
I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halston and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Yeah, yeah, find Halston, yeah, right. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. One step at a time, Nettie. Come on. Okay. Lots going on. Christ goes, the stallion disapproves pretty much of anything that might help anyone that's not him. But you don't understand. I can change him, Mum. I can change him. Couldn't agree more. Why is Gail flapping his gum so much? Shush. I believe she poisoned you. Tried to put you down like a dying dog without so much as a whisper of consent. <laughs> White Knight Gale over here, shush. It was one hell of a surprise, but Nettie came round. Only the dead dog would have been the only the only dead dog would have been her if she hadn't given in. She thought she was doing the right thing. Right? She had no right. How dare she snuff out life with as much thought as snuffing out a bloody candle? I mean, you are you're right. Asteria, and you're really quiet back there. He's here. He's here, shouting from the rooftops, trying to save me. Um, throw a fit on your own time. Right now, we need to move on. That's so mean. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Calm down, would you? It's fine. It's fine. Those, the last two are so foul. I can't say that to him. This, there really is some anti-Gale bias in this channel. No, 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 no. We're gonna be kind. It's just how. Come on, Asterion's right there. Gale doesn't exist when Asterion's right there. Are you alright, Gale? Yes. Yes, I am. It's just that... Had it been me... Had, had it, it been... been... But you handled it. You handled it well. Not really, but okay. As for myself, I could quite do with a tumbler full of water-deep whiskey. Anyway, we live... For the moment? How about we go find that chap Halsin? Little Miss Poison Ivy mentioned. With a bit of luck, he has the means to offer us a cure rather than a coffin. I know, I can't put Gale down to get Asterion to approve of me. That's just foul. That's that's just naughty of me, surely. I love seeing you get options. I miss all my playthroughs. Oh, good. I'm glad I'm showing you guys things that you didn't get in your playthroughs. That's the whole point. Cal, hey, just give Gale a shoe to chew on. He'll be all right. Bless him, he's a bit of a blowhard. But this is the thing though, because I bet you if Asterion was that upset for me, I would have been probably thrilled. But he doesn't care. He doesn't care yet, but he will care. I assume anything in red means I'm stealing. Um, and I don't want to do that yet. We've got our little thieve guild that, do that will do that. Dissected drow, jeez. Right. Um nothing else here for us, so let's go back this way. I certainly don't want to talk to her again. If Hysterion was upset for you, he should he would have killed them. Great. Give me give me that. <laughs> I don't, I don't want a man that's just going to complain on my behalf. I want murder. I want fire and blood and brimstone and, and toxicity and we just revel in each other's as bad decisions. Is that too much to ask for, guys? <sighs> right. Um... Whoa! Whoa! 
save Halson. All right. Um, what's that? Find the Githyanki crash. Save the refugees. Let's save the refugees first, I guess. Oh, yeah, I played Dog Urge. This is bound to be far more wholesome playthrough. I don't know if I if wholesome's the right term, but but something something in the middle. We're not fully fully dark at all. We we just like to flirt with it a little bit. We like to accidentally fall into dark options. You know what I mean? Uh, wait, am I going the right way? I think so. So toxic. I'm so toxic. <laughs> That's what I've got therapy for, you know? We have to pitch and send you that book. He's just not that into you. You, how dare you? How dare you? I've only just, he's, he's, Asterion's not even had enough time to get to know me. You don't know if he's that into me or not. Uh -uh. Okay, well, let's talk to you first. You're the one who helped at the gate. Glad to have another sword. We might need it. You don't know that, Gator. You don't no, know sir. that. Talk to your therapist about Sarah and see what she says. Yeah, things. yeah, yeah. They'll find it. I love how Macarbusterian yes, is all right. Not Delulu or anything. Exactly. Compared to Dark Urge, this has been wholesome. Playing this way first and a second play through Dark Urge is fab. Mm. <laughs> I love, the thing is, I wonder if my therapist knows of Baldur's Gate. I'm going to assume not. I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. Of course. If the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? Not really. Wait, what? we're not going to let violence enter the grove. Can you delay the ritual? You have to resist. Best of luck with that. This has nothing to do with me. I'm not here to advise you. I'm here to make sure you leave. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, wait, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. So we can risk violence here or face it for certain on the road. And then no, it's not the choice. Because, okay, because I was saying that they either need to leave. If they leave. If they leave, you'll run into violence. So surely you should stay on the road. Can you delay the ritual? Asterion would love me even if I was a worm. Lels gets it. Once, once Asterion gets it and he sees me and we see each other and it's like, we, it is ride or die. Yes. Can you delay the ritual? You saw what they were willing to do to a child just for trying. It's mm. Korga's influence. Without her twisting things, I believe the druids might see sense. Okay. Then why don't you get rid of her? Oh, God. Well, she is nasty. None of them like her. Why don't you get rid of her? A low thought. But I'd be lying if I said I hadn't considered it. But the druids would slaughter us. We'd have to get close to Korga, within striking distance. I can't manage that. But they've already let you pass once. Oh, God. Oh, Christ. I've painted myself in a bloody corner. Uh. Because they will be fuming. They're going to be fuming if I do it. Team Shadowheart, bless her. Shadowheart, she, she's she's quite prickly. She's not been terribly kind to anyone just yet. See, I'm with Lels on this one. Assassin Jarvis are wholesome. I just don't, I don't even know, dude. 
Every time, every time she has to pick a dialogue, oh god, I seriously, I'm painting myself in a corner. I'm not a murderer for okay. What's it worth to you? That's so callous. That's that's like. Ugh, okay, let's do, let's do, let's do. Because this, I'm not gonna send them out on the road. They're gonna, they're gonna die. But I'm also not gonna help them kill her if they want to kill her. That's not on my hand. It doesn't sit well with me either. But to get these people to safety, there's nothing I won't do. Okay. You'd be well rewarded for the risk. But if that won't sway you, no. there's nothing more to discuss. Correct. I'm not getting the blood on my hand. But now... Oh, no. Do I still... It's not completed? Save the refugees. Save the first druid. Search a house in the goblin camp. Rescue the druid Halson. Search a house in the goblin camp. Those are both main quests. Get help from the healer Nettie. Find the Githyanki crash we've not done. That's done. Hide the completed ones. Hmm. Let's go to the crash. I'm making a dog's dinner of this, guys. I don't feel good about any of this. <sighs> exactly, Alec. I started out hating Asterion, but his story and his usefulness, he stays in my party unless I remove him from someone else's story. This is my thinking, right? I think... Asterion is a little emo, moody, like, he's just, he's just misunderstood. Okay? Okay? <laughs> I think he's one of those ones, you know how you know those people where they're like, I'm gonna hurt people before I give them a chance to hurt me? He's like that. That's what he's like. Goblins, druids, this grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. He just, he's just trying to protect himself. He's just, you know, a little damaged. By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? Show some sympathy, Lazel. He's terrified. That's funny. Let's do that. Has the tadpole ravaged your senses? Sympathy will not lead us to purity. Enough. Stand down. I won't tell you again. Ooh. This feels like a good option. Doing absolutely fab and not feeling good about decisions is perfect playthrough. Thank you, Sunstreak. Thank you, thank you. I think Asterion is one of the better personal stories. He's just pretty enough to get away with my with red flags. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's misunderstood. Interested to see what you have to say in like 30 hours. I know, that is true. We may either learn something that will either confirm or like horrendously conflict with what I've said. But for now, I'm I'm going off of like what I've just picked up from, from early playing. It's clear to me, he seems like the type that wants to hurt people before he gets hurt himself. And I also think that like, I get the vibe that he has this like false bravado to to make up for actually feeling insecure that's all i'm reading into it i don't know how true it is or not okay let's let's do this stand down i won't i won't tell you again Chucky. fine you tell me where you saw the githyanki on the road to Baldur's gate n near the mountain pass S saw us for we saw it jammed its blade through Yul's belly straight to the other side man I just I just ran the map show me god calm down Oh, 
Oh, he'll just get on your nerves. I did say to Basic, and I think I said earlier on, there is a part of me that's concerned that he was going to give me the ick. So we'll see. If that's the case, I don't know. I can't. There has to be better romance options. There can't just be. Well, I'm excited to meet the other romance options because I don't know much about them at all. Um. All right, Lazel, you got what you needed. Thanks for your help. I don't know if. Thanks for your help and apologies to my companion. I feel like that's rubbing salt in the wound. No, whatever. Thanks for your help. I don't... Yeah. No hard feelings. All right. Oh God. Yeah. Now we're gonna get a bollocking from Lazal. Hang on. Let's. Uh, okay. Quick save. Yes. All right. Let's hear it. The last time a subordinate questioned my judgment, I ate tongue stew that very night. I'm not your subordinate. No, we're partners. You're treating me with respect. You've made your point. If you finish scowling me, what comes next? You shouldn't have been so rough with him. The tiefling option. You shouldn't have been so rough with him. Rough. Fuck. Soon you will be vomiting blood and tearing apart your own flesh. When the tentacles sprout from your lips, will you still cry that I was rough? The tea sling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. Ha! <laughs> we're tiefling with an F. <laughs> Ah! I am unfamiliar with the, well, I shall not say culture, custom perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this fey run. Leave the eye rolling to me. Okay. <laughs> Thing is, fey run. No, no, it's fey run. We've got to do it again. <laughs> the crash holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. <sighs> Why do you hate me, Asterion? Should we have a little talk here? Yeah. Well, hello. What can I do for you? I can't talk to him now. I can't talk to him now like this. It's just a weird time. In front of everyone, it's just not right. Have you caught on to how you need to act to get his approval? Yes, I have. Act like a effing dickhead. But I'm, just, I'm hoping that maybe, you know, I'll capture him in, in quiet little moments and we'll get closer to one another. And I can, you know, help melt his hard exterior. And so he's not such a dickhead. Maybe they just don't trust you yet. Yeah, I think this is like still early days. Lazelle is is feeling, you know, prickly. Oh wow, they're both out here. Ooh, maybe we find Halson first. And that one's return to Zutton. Uh, I don't know if I want to be doing that. So let's go. That's a fairly lovely perspective. It, well, you know, and we've got, you just have to stay positive. Because you just don't know. You don't know how it's going to turn out. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm directionally challenged. Let's talk to this guy. Bathed in the sunlight. The Blade of Frontiers. What a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart, hmm. too. The future's in good hands. Will, where, where is Will? Will! Go on. Give me a best shot. <laughs> Not bad. Again. I can't do it. 
I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Oh, I like him. Hey there, can I have a word? This world is hopeless. You're wasting your time. That's just rude. It's good advice, child. You'll do well to listen. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on, I believe in you. You can do this. Is that good advice? That you just need to buy enough time to run? Hey, I'll just, just let hey, Can I have a word? I just want to talk. Well met. The blade of frontiers at your. Sh the man's smile bends downward, and his thoughts become yours. You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. So were you. Yes, and we both carry parasites. Who was that woman, the one in your thoughts? This is a bit too keen. We don't need to come that full on. Peer further into his mind. Ooh. Yes, we put... Um, cheeky cheeky. You see the fiend again and ignite with Will's rancor. She is an infernal war devil, a threat to the living, evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Illithids infected Illithids. me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her, she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Good lord. Thanks for the follows, guys. A uh, dream, Mokman. Yeah, Karlak reference. Again, another character that I was familiar with is Karlak. Um, okay. I'm more concerned about the parasites. Just we search for healers together. Let's join forces. I'll help you cast this devil back to the hells. You have a mind flare tadpole on your head. Doesn't that worry you? Let's go with this third option. I'd be a fool if it didn't. I know the stories. Doomed to shed my skin. Become a lithid. And there's no coming back. But I haven't sprouted any tentacles. Least not yet, thank Baldurin. Could just be good luck. But sooner or later, it's bound to run out. <laughs> I'm, well, I'm not going to promise to hunt down Karlak, because I don't think that's what we necessarily agree with. Do so I say join me then, and we'll search for a cure? An excellent suggestion, but your party's full up. Go to the Still, camp. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. I like him. Go to my camp and wait for me. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. Okay, nice. I like him. Well, let's definitely save that. I know like nothing about Will. Gale approves. I, you know what I would have loved? I actually, that's the only time that I would have loved if it said Asterion disapproves because he'd be jealous, you know? Again. Now you can replace Asterion with Will. I might do. Will's quite seems quite lovely and he is gorgeous. I would just want him to be jealous. That's how someone supportive feels, yeah. <laughs> I mean this horrible, like toxic, I don't know, mess with the buddy Asterian. Okay. Um Fab, Fab, Fab. Let's go. Let's go. Well, how can I do I mm, We'll carry on with the party we have right now. I think. Makeshift prison. Oh my god. You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. 
She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way! She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. Don't be goaded into doing it. Step between the crossbow and the goblin. Shut up, those words could be your last. No, I have to stop this, and I know Asterion's gonna disapprove, but he, she didn't even kill your brother. Looks like the Absolute sent me a protector. You gonna kill her too? She's already in prison. You why? Move. Why are you gonna? Why? Okay, intimidation and persuade. Wah. This won't avenge Cannon. It won't change anything. Lower the crossbow. I'll deliver it. I'll deliver you right to your brother. But she didn't even kill your brother, right? So this won't avenge him. It won't change anything. But he didn't kill her. You want the one you like to be jealous? Yes, of course. Yeah, I want the one I like to be... Yes, right, yes. Because then that would mean he fancies me. Of course. Okay, this should be this should be easy, in theory. I just need a seven. Or higher. Did Larry make the, make the goblin girls a little hot? <laughs> hey, we won't yuck your yum, Hero Weasel, all right? You're right. I wish you weren't. I really do. Damn you. Damn it! But why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? A goblin prisoner. Her life isn't yours to take. Yeah, I'm not saying on this bullshit, vengeance eats people alive. It's not that. Because she's not a practice, she's a person. Okay, that. If she dies, she'll take everything she knows to the grave. Also true. But she is, she is a prisoner. She's in prison. You can't just shoot someone who's in prison like that. Your soft heart will be the death of us. Shush! Not sure I get that. The bars don't make her special. But fine. Whatever. It's all right, Arca. Let's go. At least Asterion doesn't have an opinion on that. Good lord. I'm gonna bite the heads off your kids. And your birdies. And your dogs. I'll kill you myself. Who who wants to, Gail wants to talk to me. Oh god. Alright, Gail, what do you want to talk about? Let me save. How are you liking the game? I'm loving the game. It's it's unsurprisingly what I enjoy about the game the most is when I'm already in the conversations with people. I'm still getting used to like navigating with the camera like blah, blah blah to be fair we've done only talking this stream i've not actually done like any combat or anything yet um but i do massively enjoy it yeah because we're anti-war crime it's a war crime isn't it i feel like most people are attractive in the game you You'll would be hard sorry. pressed to find an unattractive person i reckon twisted welcome in you're gonna oh lazel with will tired of her yeah well i figured we're gonna keep lazel with us at least for the crash side mission thing and then I'll, I'll probably swap out believe it or not but i witnessed a similar standoff back at the yawning portal of course an establishment like that invites all sorts of outlandish entertainments what's a yawning portal an inn in water deep oh never a dull moment there adventurers come from all over faerun to try their luck down the well faerun Leads into the under mountain, you see, full of death, danger, and vast amounts of treasure. Hard to resist. What's the standoff about? Oh, a drow, a dragonborn, and a cleric of Cyric walk into a bar. Your standard fare. Maybe someone was cheating at cards. Maybe it was some weird lover's quarrel. In any case, out came the crossbow and a hush fell over the entire room. We have to... I stood up and yelled, Shadow Dark Ale for everyone. And the Brown whole cheered. room applause. Tension drained <laughs> into five dozen tankards, and soon all was well again. In a place like the Yawning Portal, the most powerful magic is calling for a round of drinks. Mind you, all I did was call for ale, but you went and stood in front of that crossbow. Well, I drink to that. 
I'm so sorry. Gail reminds me so much of like an unfunny Matt Berry character. He is so much like a handful of those types of characters that Matt Berry, if you guys know the English actor, has played. But just not funny. It's true. It's come on. Where is the lie? Thank you, Drunken. Do I have a no job? Oh my God. God. It's true. Shush. Dogs. Shush. <laughs> My good tomboy. Exactly. I, for the record, I love Matt Berry. I do love Matt Berry. Um, also Magic 8 Ball. Should I be kinder to Gale? Ask again later. Remind me to ask again later. The crush is a, the crush is quite a bit off. Okay. Well, of course you love Matt Berry. You live in New York City. Oh, I think he's hilarious. Jackie Daytona. <laughs> oh, rusted prison door. Can't reach that. Um. Oh, this isn't the way to go anyway. Oh, that's just something else entirely. Ah, uh, it's like back this way, I reckon. Um, yeah, then maybe I go here? There's a reason wizards have no charisma, oh my god. The quests in your journal aren't necessarily the ones you should do soonest. It's a ways away in the story. Oh, oh, it's a ways away in the story. Then maybe, can I go to the camp without, can I go to the camp without resting? Unrelated, but do we ever get a shovel after? Oh no, I didn't. Where can I get a shovel? No, sorry. Let me let me get the shovel first. Wait, wait. Sh shovel first, and then camp. Mole sells a shovel. Okay, mole sells a shovel. Gail's voice makes me think of Alistair from Dragon Age. I've not played Dragon Age. But now maybe I want to. He's, to be clear, all of it is phenomenally well voice acted. Let me let me go to camp first. Camp and then shovel, okay? Thank you, Nitz, by the way, for saying that. I love a switch integration thing. I can look at your inventory and quest. It's crazy well done. I mean, Jesus. What a phenomenally well done game this all is, huh? Um, okay, but you guys say the things in my main mission are for much later on. Where is Will? Where is Will? There's Asterion. There's Shadowheart. Bless her in her full armor. Will? Will. The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. The Blade of Frontiers. How does the Blade of Frontiers end up chasing a devil in the hells? Karlak's fires raged in Baldur's Gate before she escaped to Avernus, as my source told it. And she was planning to return. One of the archdevil Zariel's own. Chaos incarnate, a devil with pure fire for a heart. I made my way to Avernus to stop her. She fled from my reach. Even climbed aboard the Mind Flayer ship as it screeched through the hells. I followed in close pursuit. Mm. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking. The damage she might be doing. Okay. A powerful friend with a keen interest in... Privacy. I'm sworn to say no more. Alright. Alright. What uh, else is on your mind? Both of us. Um, how did you become? How did you come to be the Blade of Frontiers? My father once said, "One does not pursue a champion's life; one merely answers its call." So it was for me. I was hunting near the Cloakwood when I heard it. A child crying out from a lone farmstead. I found him in the fields, flanked by goblins. His mother's corpse bled into the soil next to him. I don't remember much of the battle, but I remember drying the boy's tears after. Good lord. Um, what well, could be fine in saving life, you must have felt proud, and he named you the Braid of Frontiers? 
whatever became of the boy, I wonder. Goblins, pitiful vermin, easy to kill, hardly worth getting worked up about. No, what I could be finding in saving a life. Of course you felt proud. proud. No. Oh, all right, never angry. mind. Angry. Angry at the monsters preying on innocence. Angry at the so-called good gods for tolerating the cruelty of the evil. Angry at myself that it took so long for me to see the coast suffering. The frontiers demanded a blade. And so I heeded. All right. Baldurian, it's nice to finally put a face to the name. Ah. Is that how you lost your eye in the goblin battle? It was an even bloodier day and a stronger foe. It's made from pure bloodstone, carved from the Galena Mountains just north of the Moon Sea. A reminder that sometimes blood must be shed and sacrifices must be made. Ah, but that story is reserved for lifetime friends and calmer days. By all means. Um... Make some room and I'm all yours. Who... who are we... who are we replacing, Lazar? Like it's will be done. Oh wait, how do I, how do I, Karlak is man. We'll get Karlak, we'll get Karlak. Everyone's thirsting over her. I know, I know, not practically, not, Asterion is not out, don't be ridiculous. I know practically nothing about this game, except it is, it, I, there is not a, there is no possible way that I can exist in gaming on the internet and not know of the Karlak, I wanna ride you to see stars. Uh, voice line, all right? So I know that Aulia's a thirsting over Karlak, all right? Relax, we'll get her, we'll get her. How do I, how do I trade out Lazel? Of course I'm gonna keep Asteria, don't be crazy. Um, all right, let's go, let's go dismiss Lazel. What? Oh, oh, sorry, Is no. Is that blood? No, never mind. The Githyanki people have a word for men like the Blade of Frontiers. Shalark. Roughly translated, idealist do-gooder. Or better yet, benevolent burden. His confidence is an asset. His pursuit of valor, not so much. Relax. Like, she's gonna soften up a bit as well. Um... Wait for me in camp. Chuck. You believe you can survive without me? I mean, frankly, no, but I'm not arguing. Remain here. As you say, do not keep me waiting. Good lord. Gail gives college engineering student vibes. Oh my god. Okay, wait. Now, Will, let's make sure Will's part of the party. Well met. Yeah. I'd like you to join me. That's the spirit. Indeed. Oh, you're lovely. I mean, it's gorgeous. All right, so let's level him up. Here? What's his deal? What, what are you? Who? What do you do? He's a oh, he's a warlock. I don't know if I need Will and Gale in the party. Do I need a wizard and a warlock? Warlocks have fewer spells, but they f refresh on a short rest. No one needs Gale. Oh my god. Uh, okay, wait. Class features. You gain a Warlock spell slot. Eldritch innovations. Gain dispel. Okay. What kind of Warlock are you? There's no uh, There's no other kinds. There's just the one kind. Um. Command. No. No. Hellish rebuke. React to your next attacker with a flame that... Okay... Make your attacks deal an additional one to necrotic damage. Damage to the target and give it disadvantage. I feel like either the Witch Bolt, this Hellish Rebuke could be interesting. Hex OP. Um, this one's OP, Hex. I knew this horny ass community would eventually get to balls together. Of course! We're already thirsting. Earlier I mentioned a mod for unlimited companions. That would be cheating, wouldn't it? Melee and caster help balance, yeah. 
I think you think wizards are better than warlocks. Hedge Rebuke is awesome. Hex is good. Hex recast for free. I'll do Hex. Oop. Eldritch Innovations. Um, when you cast Eldritch Blast, add your Charisma modifier to damage to the damage it deals. You can cast Mage Armor on yourself at will without expending a spell slot. No, not that. You can invoke your patron's bewitching charm. You gain proficiency in deception and persuasion. You can see normally in darkness. No. You can cast false life at yourself at will. False life grants you seven temporary hit points. You can cast disfigure self. No. You can learn how to cast one of shadows. When you hit a creature with Eldritch Blast, you can push the creature up to five, five, 4.5 meters away from you. Once per long rest, you can cast Bane using a Warlock spell slot. Bane targets up to three creatures. They receive... Oi, no, no, no. You think you're going to keep both Gale and Gale and Will? Yeah, because you can replace Gale with Lazal. That's what I'm thinking, is maybe replace Gale with Lazal. Keep Will in the party as our caster. And then we've got a bit more coverage. I'm going to do Companion. Sounds amazing. But make combat take days. That's true. Quiet, have you played through this? Yeah, or not? Agonizing Blast is quite important. All right. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll take Will out for a spin. Wizards are the best to keep in my party. Um, what was the other one I wanted? No, what was the other one? No, no. Maybe that, I think. Fiendish Vigor. What is Fiendish Vigor? You can cast False Life on yourself at will at spell one without expending a spell slot. Gives me seven temporary. Wouldn't Beguiling Influence be better for me? Agree. Agonizing and Repelling is a wombo combo. Mmm. Okay. When you hit a creature with Eldritch Blast, you can push a creature up to five meters away from me. All right. We'll do, we'll, we'll do this. We'll do this. Accept it. And we can change it if we want to. She says, I'm convinced. Again? Oh my god, again. Okay, new spell, new spell. Oh, the Cloud of Daggers is a good one. Scorching Ray. Ooh, damages all nearby enemies, creatures, and objects. Creatures made of inorganic materials such as stone have a disadvantage on their saving throw. That could be good. I think we have that already, don't we? Shatter. Well, we have Cloud of Daggers on one of the other ones. So maybe we do Shatter. Something different, why not? Uh, your patron bestows a gift upon you for your loyal service. Choose one of the following packs. Gain the service of Familiar, a face spirit that takes the form of your choosing. This can be an animal imp or quasit. You can summon a packed weapon or bind the one you are wielding, making it magical. Packed weapons use the wielder's spell casting ability modifier instead of strength or dex. Your patron grants you a grimoire called the Sh Book of Shadows, which allows you to cast Guidance, Vicious Mockery, and Thorn Whip. Um... What's the point of summoning a familiar? Because that sounds fun. Find a familiar, summon a familiar that can take an animal. Summon a familiar with the form of an imp that can fly, turn invisible, and sting enemies. Summon a familiar with the form of a quasit that can turn invisible and scare enemies. Hmm. All characters have something to say when you recruit a new person if you talk to them. Same goes for certain story events. It makes a friend. I mean, that's what I'm reading here. I'm reading this as a built-in friend. And again, this might be stupid, but we... we we accept the consequences. That uh, might have been silly. I, I, I don't know. I might regret that. Uh, let's save. How many? I think it said 11 hours, right? Okay. Now, hang on. Let's talk to Asterion.
Let's chew the fat. No, 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 not you, not you, not you. So, we're traveling with the famed Blade of Frontiers. I feel safer already. <laughs> tell me about yourself. Oh, what's to tell? I'm a magistrate back in the city. It's all rather tedious. Indeed. Damn it. He doesn't want to talk to me, guys. I have a lot on my mind. He doesn't want to talk to me. In it. What did you just say? I have a lot on my mind, and then what? Not a lot in it? A little more utility in combat. Can do some attacks, pull some aggro. They aren't useless. Thank you. Thank you. He's so interesting. Much to say. He's playing hard to get. He is playing hard to get. He's, he's, you know, he's just like not an open book, guys. He's, he's just, he's not like, he's not like all the other girls. Oh, this is the mirror. Let's see what this does. This is the magic mirror. I like that you can tell I'm running barefoot. Oh, and a lot in it. Thank you. Uh, okay, wait, wait, wait. The one thing that I did potentially want to check my eyes my left eye my left eye is this one what is that one no no no, 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 no. that yeah yeah sorry 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 yes yes my right eye what cut my right eye is like this it's a white yes I want it white uh, maybe like this. What color is this? Solid white. White one. Solid. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think solid white looks better. Opal? No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Like this. And then, and then... Not that. Piercings. Midnight tears, I think, still makes sense. Yeah. No, no, stop. Pick your head up. I can't see. No, no, no we're going to stick with midnight tears. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Oh! All right, we're fine. We're fine. Uh, okay. Time to leave. Leave camp. How's Gobbo? He's good. He needs to go to the vet. He needs to go for his annual checkup. Uh, okay, I need a shovel. And you guys said there's a shovel on the ground somewhere. Do you know whereabouts on the ground the shovel is? There's a pile you pass by the crash with a shovel. There's a pile I passed by the crash. Should I transport to the roadside cliffs then, I guess? Is that closer? Not far from the broken trap. The broken trap. Wasn't the broken trap somewhere around here? I thought. South southwest. No. Well met. No, I, I don't want to talk right now. Yeah, it's on the path just above the crash, so roadside is a good teleport. Okay, on, it's on a path just above the crash. On a path just above the crash. Does this count as just above? Yeah, right? Moving ahead. Uh, up this way. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Well, don't all be m okay, whatever. No, north? 
Is this not? Am I not going the right way? It was a time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere wet oh, here, here, could swap up. me halfway to arm. Strange Lovely. things are happening to us. What festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. Gail's really got the gift of the gab, huh? That man knows how to talk. Um, now I think I want to go here. So I think there was another pile that I could dig up. Who said eight intelligence things? You guys are so mean. Oh no, maybe if I go through here. Uh, no, 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 no. This is probably better. Sorry. Like this way, I think. I kind of like the crash site stays there for a while, you know. The Leaping Borders Gate quality from Borders Gate 1 and 2 to this is insanity. Never heard of a vampire called Casador? Well, it doesn't ring a bell. Why? He's patriarch of the Tsar family. Nasty fellow, if the histories are accurate. I imagine they are. Why didn't you ask me about the vampire, Hysterian? Oh, scroll of sleep, scroll of false life, gold. Okay, cool. Um, love that. How? Sorry, wh what? When did Baldur's Gate two come out? Um, all right. I reckon we start to go. I mean, Jesus, hunt down Karlak. Uh, yeah, okay, so the crash is a ways away still. Do I hunt down Karlak or hunt down Hulsen first? I wonder. Um, what is... We recruited Will, a monster hunter known as the Blade of Frontiers. He's on a mission to kill Karlak, a powerful devil who's danger, who is a danger to the entire, entire Sword Coast. Hulsen? I think Holson. We'll do Holson first. 2001. I mean, Jesus. You guys have been waiting a long... Baldur's Gate fans have been waiting a long time for a Baldur's Gate game. It's a good thing it lives up to everything I assume you guys are hoping for. He's just not into you, Java. He really isn't. We've not, like, had enough time... But he is really not that into me. Check out the place everyone missed a survival check. What place was that, Alec? Karlak will take you less time than Holson. I'd say Karlak if you want her to fight with you to get Holson. Mm. Shame no other good RPGs have come out since then. <laughs> We've been starved. Not a singular one has come out in the past 23 years. Holson is a big story beat. Okay. Okay, Holson is a big... Carlac's probably better to do first. Okay, alright, alright, alright. It was at the ruin. It's not important. Alright, then we will get Carlac first. And I bet you guys are just telling me to get Carlac because you guys are thirsting over her. And frankly, I can't blame you. Um... Let's try going out this way, I guess. Like that. <laughs> Loop de looping all over the place. I'm totally lost. That makes two of us. Hey, Becky girl, thank you so much for the tier one. Five months, you lovely. How's it going? A Ma question for our master monster hunter. How would you approach? Killing a vampire. To start, lure it into the sun, drive a stake through its heart. Why? Just curious. Th 
thank you, you lovely. Yes, guys, more hype. How's it going, Becky? It'll take you like five times to get Halston, and Karlik is a people up ahead. Something it's a good wrong. addition. Okay, okay, cool. Well, I'm glad it's saved. Also, this is like multiple, uh, multiple uh, vampire questions. Asterion is asked, "Will you're going to be all right? You're a true soul. You can't die. Please stay with us." I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange symbol glows, marked on their flesh. And something within you stirs in response. So wisdom we've got plus three. Illithid wisdom. Being implanted with a mind fairy tadpole is a fate worse than death, isn't it? Ill illithid. Illithid. Illithid, I think is how they pronounce it. Uh, no, let's do the medicine one. This this is illithid is the mind flayer stuff, so that's nasty. We don't want to be leaning into that. Okay, cool. I just need a seven. I need a seven or higher. He's hurt badly. An oil bear got him deep. Well, if there's anything you can do, I'm watching you. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. Try to block him out. Useless. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brenna. New recruits, yours to shepherd. Protect them. She is a true soul. Mind her. She will. She. She. Edwin! Ed! Please! He's with the Absolute now. You're... you're a true soul. Edwin, our brother, he was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Damn, sorry, I know a lot happened, but I was too busy staring at my dogs. Did you guys see how long my toenails are? Bro, there's no way I could fit those into shoes. Anyway, it's a good thing I've chosen to be a barefoot... a barefoot, um... <laughs> Barefoot tiefling. Hepari, welcome in. True soul. True soul. Am I, I don't know. Am I supposed to know what that means? I kind of like, I'm so sorry. I like ADD like blacked out a bit as they were talking because of the toes. You're a cult leader now. That's what you missed. Dang it. But he, okay, hang on, hang on. Let me actually try and piece this together. He, he had a mind flayer thing in his mind as well, right? Because he understood me we were speaking we were communicating with one another explain this absolute to me perhaps you can help me i'm looking for the druid halson why are you out here the wilderness is dangerous you need to find the beast and avenge your brother true soul true maybe we'll, there is a conversation log uh conversation log dialogue history yeah okay okay You're a true soul. You can't die. Please stay with us. I don't think he's conscious. Can you hear? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His wounds look deep. I might be able to help. He's hurt badly. An owl bear got him deep. The injured man locks eyes. You familiar squirming turns in your head. Your minds. You see his siblings. New recruits. Your shepherds. And he says she's a true soul. Mind her. She will. She. Da 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 da. Okay. True soul. What? Are you? Are you testing us? Yes. A true soul like you has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice. Your words are her command. She grants you the power to enforce her will. And when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. Oh, I like these two. 
All zeal and no brains. My 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 boyfriend likes you. A crude summary. You have more to learn of our faith than novice. Well, I'm not going to try and do all that. Um, I'm not going to say you're mistaken. I'm no true soul either. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm huffing the copium here. Leave, leave me be, guys. <laughs> the del I'm Delulu. Um, you need to find the beast and avenge your brother. Do I think that they have the ability to avenge the brother and stay safe? I'm not so sure. Why, why are you out here? The wilderness is dangerous. We know that all too well, ma'am, but the Absolute sent us here. We're looking for fugitives, survivors from that ship that crashed farther west of here. These fugitives. Tell me more. We don't know what they look like, but anyone who survived that crash is bound to be injured. That's enough to get us started. The Absolute wants them found. At any cost. Um, well, I'm not gonna, okay, I'm not gonna say I'm a survivor of the crash. That's just crazy. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for the Druid Halson. I don't know any Druids. God damn it. Uh, you need to find the beast and avenge your brother. I'll, I'll, I'll avenge, you, you're, just go. Because if I say you find... Okay, if I say you need to find the beast and avenge your brother, they're going to die. They're going to die facing the beast because, like, look at them. There's no shot that the two of them are going to be able to take it on. And then I'm going to feel like a dickhead for sending them off to their death. But I'm sure as shit not going to tell you that I'm a survivor of the crash because I you have, you have bad intentions. I feel like that's sending... The, uh, there's no winning. There's no way to not send them to their death. Don't you think number two is like... Because they... 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 Hang on. Why are they... What are you testing? A true soul like you has been chosen by absolute. You speak with her voice. Your words are her command. She goes to the... Yeah. And when time comes, the true souls you will rule. Yeah. We know that all too well, but the absolute sent us here. We're looking for fugitives, survivors from the cr from the ship that crashed farther west of here. These fugitives tell me more. We don't know what they look like, but anyone who survived that crash is bound to be injured. That's enough to get us started. The absolute wants them found at any cost. But I'm the absolute. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm a true... But see, that's the thing. Do would I want the absolute to find me? I don't feel like they have malicious intent. I don't know. Well, here, we'll do this. You! Brenna! Kill her! You, they, they, I blame chat for this one, but now we got to kill them. Um, okay, Gale's first. Chat's trolling me. I should have known. I should have known. Magneto, welcome in. This just feels sad, like a little baby bit. The Sarian is going to love it. That is true. Okay. Um, can we attack with... Okay. Nine... No, let's do like this. 
Hang on, hang on. Do like, do like this. Let's play. Let's play, yes. Oh, and that used my bonus action as well. All right. Survival is all that matters. Shillelagh. Eldritch Blast. Hoppa! Oh, I thought she evaporated. I was like, Jesus! Two steps at a time. Mm. Good Lord. Um, Mom, the trick is just pick charisma, but. Do I click it on myself? Wait, sorry, do I click it on myself or on the other person? <laughs> sorry, on the enemy, thank you. Damn. Embarrassing myself in front of him. This is my time. Please. It was not cleanly one, but one nonetheless. Asterion, how, how do you feel after that? Yes. He has nothing to say, chat. He has nothing he wants to say. Is Basel dead? No, 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 no. We've not gotten her yet. I, I thought I was going on the right path to get her. But I now feel like I'm not. Oh, no, 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 no. I am. Maybe. Um, short rest? I'm the only one that's still injured. Maybe I don't know. Oh, lovely little pick me up. Sure. Uh, Skizzit, welcome in. Nope, she's east. Basic, welcome in. How's it going? Uh, is no hunt down Karlak here. So I don't see a way. That looks like a dead end here. I think this was a dead end here. So I was going to try and loop around to see if I can get it from this way. But if I can't, then then I'll go back. We're trying to do this first. How am I feeling? Better. Lazel. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. Someone asked me if Lazel's dead. I'm sorry. No, she's not. She's at camp. We're hunting down Karlak. I got them confused. That's my bad. That's my bad. We're going, we're going for Karlak. We've got Lazel. We've got she's just being moody at camp. You should search that corpse. Yes, of course. Maybe I'll need more pockets. Do I need more pockets? Well, hang on. I'll give stuff to you guys. 
Uh, here, you can be encumbered. You can hold all this shit. And you can hold that. And these are for you. Lovely. This is a howling wasteland. I haven't even had a bath since the abduction. <sighs> I must reek of a little slime. I know, babe. I know. We'll go take a bath together. Think of the stories you'll be able to tell. Gale is way too over the top. He's doing the most right now. Truly. Like, come on. A cave? A cave. Oh, I think that's kind of heading the right way. Why? Why the hate for Asterian? I like Will. I do like Will. I don't like that Will is a warlock. I don't know how I feel about warlock. Breathe deep and move. Because everyone just says it's warlocks are worse wizards, you know. Okay. Hang on. Thank you for the follows, guys. Massive welcome and lovely followers, by the way. I'm thrilled that you're here. Wait. Do I have this activated? All right. I Talk to me. Oh. Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. What happened here? I told, I told you, you to, to go. go. Whoa, we've got a lot of options here, guys. Uh, all right. So we can use perception, which I've got plus three wisdom. We're obviously not going to intimidate. That's crazy. Calm, friend. I mean you no harm. That looks good. I understand your fear, but I promise I mean you no harm. I feel like this is the best. Calm, friend, is like... That's being, um... That's being... I'm talking down to the... You know, him. I understand your fear, but I promise I mean you no harm. Yes. 15, Jesus. Okay. 15, that means I need one of these to at least roll a 12. I have to reset. I have to reset. I can't fuck this up. These worlds crawl with monsters. You could be one of them. Come, friend. I mean you no harm. I really, really mean it now. I mean you no harm. Okay, guys. It's fine. I need one of these to roll at least a 12, okay? Yeah, this is the most important thing we've done so far. Mm. There's death in your scent, but not in your words. Still, you should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. <laughs> rest? He needs a grave. That seems so foul. That's so mean. I don't think he's going to wake up. I think he's a little softer. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. I'm going to cry. Prove the man is dead. Shout out the corpse. Come on. Um, what happened to your friend exactly? We were attacked. We're cackling furry things on two legs. Okay. And their smell. It was strange. Rotten. Evil. Cackling furry you know things. the creatures he describes. Knolls. Oh, okay. All right. All right. What's your name? He calls me Scratch. 
You can do the same. Deal. Come on, you can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave him. If he doesn't wake up, follow my scent. I have a camp. If it comes to that, I may. Thank you. So now here's a question though, right? For people, because I'm the druid, right? I'm a druid, so I can talk to animals. For people that can't talk to animals, what do you do during that section? Do you not have the option to talk to him or? Asterian's not a dog person. Asterian would love my pet cat. Successful interaction, yeah, achieved. Can I, can I pet you? Go on. No. If he doesn't wait, I'll find you. All right. Um, what's Will got over his head? What the hell is over your head? And maybe that's the charisma? Yeah, concentration hack. Okay, okay. I think that's what it is. If it's not, then I don't know. Now, hang on. Carla is over there, but now I want to hunt down. Is that not a quest item? No, why isn't it a quest item? To hunt down the, the, whatchamacallit? Oh, you can drink the potion. People communicate with animals despite not knowing the language in real life all the time. You are correct. You're not, you're not wrong, are you? Miss out on many voiceovers without talk to animals. I'm so happy that I picked the druid. One, I, I think it suits, it's been suiting me well. And it suits my character well as a moon druid. Oh, wait, hang on. No, we ca we came up from that way, I think. Is there anything this way? No, no, no. I just want to help. Perception for what failed? What might be worth a look? What what might be worth a look? Oh, the rocky crevice. Well at least one of us has good enough chance I'll fit in there. Who no no one can fit in there. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Can I do I want to mark this for any reason? Rocky crevice? Oh, I can turn into the cat! Oh, wait, hang on. Hang on, hang on. You're an impressive fighter game. You should consider a new name. Wait, 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 cancel. The Wizard Wonder. Or, how about the Master of the Weed? Okay, saved. Now, turn into a cat. Look at me! I'm a unit! So cool. Alright, in your pop. Thank you. Who said that? Whoever it was that said that, thank you very much. Your main is a druid. You can use the other wild shape into a cat. Welcome in, Lazy Titan. And thank you guys so much for the follows. Massive welcome in, lovely people. Whoa. All right, but here's the thing. I'm in the owlbear nest. But I can't fight by myself. So maybe what can I do? What can I do? Mm. What's that? Dirt mound? I can't do anything with that right now. Um, well, I don't know what to do here. What can I do here? 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 Uh, 
I could probably jump down. I wouldn't want to jump down. Because I'm going to get in trouble. Exactly. I have no health. I've got just 2 HP. Can I find... Is there a way that I can open this up for my friends? How do we get in here? What else is in here, I wonder? Okay. No. I wonder maybe if I leave, will it let me report back? No. But I know now that somewhere here is the Albert cave. And I don't think there was anything else I was meant to do in there. But we know that it's there. I guess. Okay. Um... An exsanguinated ball. My god. Strange. It looks healthy. A dead boar. But it doesn't look like it's been touched by scavengers. Medicine to examine it? I need a 10, so I need at least a 7. The carcass seems to be fresh. Only a few hours dead. You notice two small puncture wounds in its neck. Mm. Looking closer, you can see the skin around its face is desiccated. It's been completely drained of blood. Hmm, two small puncture wounds and it's been exsanguinated. It would almost sound like it's been nibbled on by a vampire. Done it. Do we need to have words with my boyfriend who hates me? Yes. I couldn't help but notice your extremely long canine teeth. Do you have anything you'd like to tell me? Uh, am I not grouped up? Group. Yeah, everyone come with me. Thank you very much. So now let's all go examine the ball together. Hysterian. Do you have anything you'd the like? The dead, my friend. Staring at it won't bring it back. Come on. We'll never fix these brain worms if we stop and gawk at every piece of carrion you find. My love. <laughs> Um, we are silver-tongued, so let's go with persuasion. These marks are strange. Do you recognize them? Okay, we need at least a seven. Please! No, we're going to charm him. We're going to charm him. <laughs> Mr. Robot, welcome in. Exhibit A, Your Honor. Ball with no blood and punctured holes on the neck, no less. I... It's been drained of blood with wounds in its neck. It's been killed by a vampire. Indeed. I didn't want to say anything because I didn't want to worry you. They are ferocious creatures. But don't worry. I'll keep watch tonight. We won't have to worry about nocturnal visitors. Now please, let's go. Guys, did you hear that? He said he's going to keep watch over me tonight. I'm in love. <laughs> Thank you for the follows, guys. They, he said. I know. Well, no, but here's the question, though. And maybe, okay. I'm going to ask the question. But don't answer if this is a spoiler, okay? I wonder... 
because I went into the cave as the cat, did he do this, like, in the time where I was away in the cave? No, he couldn't have. He couldn't have because then my co- my- my companions would have seen him do it and been like, uh, hello, what are you doing? The delusion just grows stronger. Leave me alone, guys. Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Insert the Phoenix right Ace Attorney image. I think, I think Gasterian also has puncture wounds on his neck. I think I saw that when I first met him. I, I'm trying to get to Karlak, but I feel like I'm going in the wrong way. I don't want to do, I'm trying to get to Karlak before Halson. Um... But this is all croggy, croggy, right, croggy, cro How do I say that word? Craggy rock face, craggy rock face. So it's funneling me in here. Jeez, there's a whole town here. Yeah, he does, right? He does. If you want to get to car like fast way, go back to scratch and walk towards the water. Let's try that. Let's go back to scratch. Because that's a whole hubbub over there. Back to scratch. Great music. Like, you know we're about to encounter something crazy. Check out the river north of me. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. I thought I came from this way. I don't know. Why did I think I... I really feel like I came from this way. But I must not have. Okay, can't get there. Um... Oh! Need something? I mean, yes, but I actually wasn't trying to speak to you just then. Oh, I've got to jump! I've got to jump! I'm sorry, I keep on forgetting that I can do stuff like that. Uh, jump, 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 jump. Jump! Uh, I don't know if I can jump that far. Quint, by the way, welcome in. It's okay, guys. This is gonna be fine. Well done, you brave people. Wow, I can thank you guys for saying that. As like absolutely shameful as this is to say, I actually don't know if I would have thought in my brain to jump over that. How sad is that? It takes a while to get used to how important jumping is in some areas. Yeah, I don't. It just did not remotely clock in my brain as something to do. Hang on. Sorry, I'm like so directionally challenged. Yeah, that's Karlak. And I'm glad we've got Will with us because I reckon there's going to be some interesting dialogue. Wait, are they not following me? Guys! Are you okay? Job as ever. Yeah. Are these Asterians the only smart one? Gail. Up already. Let's move. Can we all are we all happy now? The board. So I have to do everything around here. Mm. Troll collector's key. Key. Wonder what it opens. Balladonna. Magras. 
And then a very wounded Korlak. Need to find the way forward. I know I just saved, but I'm scared. I'm surrounded by men after all, it's true, Kodashan. The stink of Avernus. Advocatus Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. Damn! So it's either you're the devil we've been hunting, Karlak, right? Tell me, monster, what's it like to know you're about to die? Do you know what? If I was such a heinous person, like truly madly deeply, like an agent of chaos, so heinous, I would kill off Karlak right now just because I know how much chat would absolutely flame me. I know how upset so many of you would be. It would be funny to like, pu purely for like the chaos of it, it would be hilarious to do. <laughs> Don't you dare, exactly. Yeah, yeah, flame, yeah, yeah, see what you did. I see, Spectre, yeah, me with the Sterian, you guys are rude. Do it, no, Go you guys would despise me. I wouldn't have a community to speak of anymore. He speaks random Latin words like that. How much of a nerd are you? He is such a nerd. Sean, welcome in. I'll be Govdan. It's so funny to me for some reason. That is entirely fair. Do it. Go to the dark side. Asterion actually, frankly, would like it. You are right. If I'm trying to win over Asterion, killing Karlak might do it. If I kill Karlak, I get Asterion to like me. Will will be happy with me. And I would have monumentally pissed off chat. I think it's like a win-win-win, right? Surely. Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome in. Stand with your guts. Do it. Can't be more evil. No, I can't. I can't. Can't be more evil than what other streamers I've seen. Oh, my God. Can you say what other streamers... Without spoiling, can you say what other streamers have done? My God. Double dog dare you. I can't, bro, I can't. She'll... Like, there would be no coming back from it. Maybe we'll kill her off late. I can't kill her off right now. But we, she may die later on. Um, okay. So you're the devil we've been hunting, Karlak, right? There are no natural frames. Prepare to fight. <laughs> well, the thing is, like, I've not been hunting you. Like, I've not hunted you. He, he's been hunting you. Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... <sighs> Wouldn't you know it? Wars through you. Her heat. Fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood, the blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain, but it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils, Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Or near it, anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. Damn. Tim, go have a great night's sleep. Oh, genocide is fairly... Co oh, my word. Fairly common amongst other streamers. Damn, some streamers are genocidal maniacs. On their first playthrough? God damn. Uh, okay, stand down, Will. You saw I saw. Be practical. She is infected. Same as us. And powerful tool. We can use her as an ally. Looks like you found your mark, Will. Let's send your devil back to the hells. No, stand down. You saw what I saw. Calm your tits. Will catches his breath and his lips straighten. Sheer dread twists his face. You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil. I'm asking you to trust what you saw, Will. 
gods, you're stubborn. Karlak's not a devil and you know it. You saw her thoughts. She poses no danger to the Sword Coast. Gods, you're stubborn. No, you saw her thoughts. We're going to reason with you. Shockingly. <laughs> Asterion you know approves! Right. Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? Correct. I've... I've been deceived. Yeah. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... I'm Java. Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? Little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. But devils don't like to lose their assets. <laughs> Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of tear, to take me back. Problem is, I'm not going. Okay. Um... Why should I do your dirty work? So you want me to kill the people hunting you? No, send them back to where they came from. Come on. One, all for one and one for all. Fuck yes. They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Then we can work on evicting this parasite and take Faerun by their short hairs. Sound good? She's, uh, perhaps a little rough around the edges. But I suppose I can be smooth enough for two. I uh, actually is he already is he already grafting onto Karlak? It kind of seems like he's grafting onto Karlak a little bit. Randy, greetings, welcome in chat. How's it going? He's so sweet. He's not sweet. He's trying to flirt with Karlak right in front of my bloody face. He's been flirting with me the whole time. It's perhaps a little rough around the edges, but I suppose I can be smooth enough for two. Yeah, 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 I guess. Sounds like a great plan. Uh, yeah, 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 sounds like a great plan. Yeah, yeah. I'd hug you if it wouldn't scorch your skin off. Uh, hang on, though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? Okay. So Will has something that he wants to say. Journal updated, three new journal updates available. What have we got? Uh, Nortoy crash region, hunt the devil. Talk to Will about Karlak. And is that actually at the crash site? Potentially. I don't know, I'll talk, let's talk to Will first. Hunt the devil, confront the paladins. But I feel like I should do that with Karlak. You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. Oh, bless you, Will. Oh, what? <laughs> Hang on. Will just says, you've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say, and I've played my part all too poorly. I understand that. You understand that. Because, like, we have brains. We understand what he means. I know what a pantomime is. Please tell me why my character, which has minus one intelligence, goes, what's that supposed to mean? Lay it out plainly, Will. <laughs> I don't want to have to roleplay as a moron, but they're making it very easy. Someone set you on Carlyke's tail. I'd like to know this source of yours. If you weren't so useful, I'd drive a dagger through your skull. Good lord. I can say only this. Karlak's not the only one who's had a villain's knife held to their throats. 
Right. You sound like a man with the nine hells at his heels. You're closer than you know. One night soon when we make camp, the veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. A dance, a chance to see the blade squirm, perhaps? Penance, should I be worried? You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. Oh, for God's sake, out with it. All right. Um, well, I want to carry on with Karlax's quest, I think. Yeah, so maybe we do another save. Sorry, because I'm obsessive. And then we go to camp. And then who do you think I should trade out for Karlak? I kind of feel like Gale, not Asterion. Don't be crazy. I think Gale, right? Yeah, let's trade out Gale. I'm ignoring anyone that says Asterion. Mine's one intelligence, me IRL. No, don't say that. <laughs> oh, bless him. It's, it's a contrast to say Will is my least favorite companion. He's so boring. Is he? He... Well, I don't know about whether or not it's controversial because I don't know enough. Always at your side. Um, his his he's set up with like a bit of intrigue right now, like him right out the gate wanting Carlac like dead. Devil and Devil Hunter standing shoulder to shoulder against a common enemy. Rather, Rather poetic. poetic, I think. Um, there's a bit of intrigue. Oh, I think I have a magical artifact you'll be interested in. Your enterprising approach to my problem is most encouraging. But it is a delicate process to keep my condition stable. I do not yet need to consume an item, but keep it close by. It will not be too much longer. Can't you just hold it? I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. I'll be here in the meantime, idling away the hours. Anyway, um, yeah, I don't know. Will's had like enough intrigue set up. Like, what's his deal with the stone eye and his dislike of Karlak? Um, but we'll see how his how his personality progresses. I what's will say. So obviously, I've not played the game. I've lurked some people's streams. Will and Halson are characters that I know, characters that have been introduced to the game right now that I know the absolute least about. Like going into playing Baldur's Gate, I knew of Asterion, I knew of Gale, I knew of Karlak, Shadowheart, and Lazel. And that's like about it. And I would assume that's because not many people talk about Will and Halson. But don't correct me. Don't like tell me otherwise. Will's very one dimensional, that's a shame. Um, okay, we do have a lot of questions here. So how'd you end up fighting in the Blood War? Trust me, I'll tell you all about it after we take care of the goons on my team. Right. Oh, come on then, let's head out. Fuck yes. Karlak is very... Right. You feel very strongly about that? All right, all right. Hey, John Doe. Welcome in, lovely. How's it going? What's so funny? You haven't got some laughing curse, have you? <laughs> I really made it out of Avernus. It's incredible. All right, just keep it down. We're conspicuous enough without your hyena call. All right. Very well. Now, where is it? I need to go, like, up and to the right. I'm here for your delusions. One day, maybe they will come reality. <laughs> We've, uh, I've had barely enough time. Just, just get, I've not yet had a, enough chance to have a crack at it, you know? Like, don't worry. We'll, we'll get there. If I have enough time to have a good crack, you know? Wait, 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 wait. We all failed.
I don't understand. We all failed some kind of survival check, but I don't know what it was checking for. <laughs> a piece of toast, welcome in. How's it going, lovely? I remember to level her up. Shit, shit, Making shit, shit, shit. Thank you. Who said that? Robot, thank you very much. Mr. Robot, Mr. E Robot. A barbarian. Color me astonished. Easy peasy. Le okay, okay. Race, Zariel Tiefling. Subclass, Wild Heart. Your attunement with nature and its beast inspires your rage, empowering you with a supernatural might. Violence is both a means to an end. It's both a means and an end. You follow a path of untrammeled fury, slick with blood as you thrill in the chaos of battle, heedless of your own well-being. A wild influence of magic has transformed you, suffusing you with an arcane power that churns within you. Okay, so hear me out. I I don't know if I want her... Would I want her to have this bestial thick? Because I'm the druid. So is that then dub doubling up when it doesn't need to be doubled up? Or... Because I feel like... Wild Heart is cool, but it's druid light, right? I feel like this might be more fun. Huge pothole. Karlak is supposed to be an amazing demon slayer. Yeah, yeah, she's level one. That definitely tracks. Wild Heart is cool, but it's like, yeah, yeah. Wild Heart isn't spell cast, so wild magic is chaotic and fun. It's chaotic and fun. Berserker usually in games like, in games it's like super high damage with the high risk downgrades, okay. Berserker is great fun with extra attacks. We gotta go Berserker then. Alright. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Not the three, Kong. Uh, Alright. Save, 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 save. I'm back. We found the wife. Welcome back, Kaya. You can't leave stream now. None of yours can leave stream ever, ever again. And you all have to be in every single stream. Amen, all right? Promise, Ooh. promise, promise. <laughs> Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome in. Okay, lovely. You can always respec. That's true, that's true. Good Lord. Hang on, hang on. I should be doing this. Damn, Karlak has so much HP. Yeah, these really are hyenas, huh? Mm, someone's talking. Shab behind the shabby wooden doors. Good grief. Oh my days. I won't make promises I know I can't keep. What is, I feel like the way that that was phrased, it's from something. What's no? What's hiding here? Why are you manually saving? Did your F1 key break already? No, I'm just trying to switch Open it up. up. Chat scared me about yeah, no. F5-ing too much. And is that sulfurite? Mysterian, I love you. Even though you killed the boar and you're pretending like you didn't. I mean, good lord. Well, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's not get carried away. <laughs> How much further can I go? I enjoy wild magic. Randomized buffs on range made every encounter different. Interesting. Welcome in, Diane Often. 
Yeah, Zarka's want to frenzy at the start, which fits her, her, her character quite well. If it scares you too- no, Pete, you- chat scared me about using it too much. They were like, you're gonna- you're gonna- you're gonna break it off. If you use it too much, you're gonna- you're gonna- it's gonna fall off. Seems simple enough. If you F5 too much, you're gonna blind yourself. That's what they said. I need a quick word. Please, no more. Leave us in peace and we shall leave you in kind. Yeah, you're gonna put your eye out. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please, we just want to go home. It says his posture, his eyes, is he telling the truth? Whoa, yeah. Cool. I need a five or higher. This is almost impossible to muck up. There's something in the squint of his eye. You suspect he's lying. There's something in the squint of his eye. You suspect that he's lying. Enough of this charade. I know who you really are. Enough. Enough. I'll not play pretend anymore. Karlak, you're going home in pieces if needs must. And you, you'll soon learn what it means to ally yourself with the likes of this garbage. Avernus was never my home. It was my prison. I'm free now. And I'm never going back. Good lord. Hey, 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 hey. My God. Huh? Why am I in there by myself? Good lord, Friars ass, bro, I'm trying. All right, all right. We need, okay. Come like here. Through the choke at least. Then ranged attack. We might be in trouble. Oh, I don't have enough movement. I don't have movement. Um, no. C cancel. 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 Ca how do I? How do I cancel it? How do I cancel it? Yeah, these guys. The guys are beefy boy. They both are. I thought it was right click to cancel. Too late. You rolled already. But I. I, I don't have no movement. Phew. Uh, all right. Well, whatever. I was about to keep going. Um. All right. Heal myself. No, I should turn into the. I should turn into the bear. Bam. I knew it. I knew those damn bot. Whoa! Someone can drop that though. Provides an attack opportunity. Provide all of this provides attack opportunities. Provokes attack opportunity. Damn. Hang on, but I have to move. I can't stay here. Because I'm in his radius. Because I'm in his radius. He 
hit. I can't. I already did hit him. So I was just gonna move. So I think I think it missed because the desk was in the way. I should have moved first and then hit him. I made a mistake, Chad. I made a mistake. This guy fucks romance him quick. I got smacked. Hex him first. Hex, 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 hex. Select charisma. A cleric might come in handy. You mean like the one that I have back at camp November? Um, okay. Frankly, it might be safest to keep Will back here. Eldritch Blast? Let's go. Of course, this she's all the way back here. All right, what have we got? Cleave, prepare. Legacy of Avernus Searing Smite. Deal an extra damage and set your target on fire. Hell yeah. R right? Reckless attack, therm thermaturgy, range attack, cleave, main hand, piercing, lacerate. Yay! Uh, this, surely. Wait, they said use a frenzy skill first. Uh, cancel. Oh yeah. Shit! No! I thought someone said C to cancel. I swear, someone said C to cancel. I've got my berserker hiding now, motherfucker. <laughs> I hate myself. I hate everyone. I tried. I tried right click to cancel last time and it didn't work. Dude, not shadow like. You're rude. Dumb. This is why you gotta play the game sometimes. Bro, I clicked right to try and cancel Asterion's hide. And I said, guys, why isn't it canceling? I thought it was right to click to cancel. And someone goes, oh, it's C to cancel. Cause I guess it's C to cancel the Asterion's hide. So I was like, okay, this time, bet. I'm gonna use C to cancel and not the right click. You can even see in my little baby brain, C cancel, C cancel. I'm so sorry, Dom and Raiders, welcome in. I'm thrilled that you're here. You've come in at a very interesting time. Um, I've just mucked up doing something and I've now done possibly like what could have been the worst decision for my character to do. Um, so we're living with that consequence. I know I could reload, I know I could reload, but maybe we try like, maybe we try this out and see how far I can, I can get in the fight doing just this, right? You can't cancel actions. You rolled to see if they succeeded. He rolled his hide check, so no cancel, bro. No. Dom, how was your stream, lovely guys? If you're not following Dom, please give the lovely Dom a follower and follow. And Dom and Raiders, welcome in. It happens to the best of us. I don't know how many times I've accidentally clicked the space bar and ended my turn. Thank you, Ulchik. I think I'm saying that right. Welcome in, lovely. Um. All right. Well. Okay, well, this is the thing. If I fail the battle, then I'll just reload the save. <laughs> but for the time being... Ah, uh, your rage turns into frenzy. You gain frenzy strike and enrage throw. Okay, well, let's... Let's try and get closer to the situation, at least. We're gonna... We're, we're rectifying this one thing at a time. 
Let's get me through the door and like here. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right. So that's going to end my turn. Um, okay. Bruh. How? This is crazy, dude. Now you gotta. Now, now you get to see what happens. <laughs> this non lethal attack? No. Um, deal regular damage and possibly inflict gaping wound, which causes extra damage on attacks. Okay. Possibly throw your enemy off balance. No, no, no. Okay, but... Conjure one beam of cracking energy. Yeah, okay, now what do I have as... The Hex we've already used on him. So let's try the Blast. Again. Oh, because the target's too close. Uh, okay, wait. Cancel. But it provokes the attack opportunity. <laughs> um, which we just can't have happen right now. So we're just going to do up close and personal Eldritch Blast. Because I moved? Because I moved? Bruh! Why? I hate everything! Okay. Frenzy. For myself. We're just- we're just seeing what we can do at this point. Like, I don't- oh damn it. Oh, because it requires the bonus action, motherfuckers! Until your next turn, you have advantage of attack rolls, but enemies also have advantage against you. Let's just do the last array. Why not? I mean... What? Once per round, a character can react to another action. Manage your available reactions in the reactions tab. Karlik used last array on Anders. Karlik needs to hit 14 to hit. They roll a 7. I mean, we're gonna lose this. <laughs> In the arms of the angel. Yeah, there we go. Roll credits, guys. It's the end of the playthrough. Thank you guys so much for being here. I must be appreciate your time uh, and, and attention on this playthrough. God damn it. It's part of the learning process. Uh, okay. I guess this one, right? Surely that should be fine. Now you prepare... Jesus. I mean, guys, those were really tough enemies. I feel like those were so tough. Like, way tougher than... You might want to look if you have better armor. Oh, maybe better armor. Yeah, maybe. Should I play some sad Celine Dion? Yeah. Uh -huh. Where? What level is she? We're all level three. We are all level three. 
Open with entangle, follow up with ice knife, make them get crowd controlled, shoot at them from distance, put Karlak up front, she can get a couple hits. You can take this fight, I believe in you. I don't know. The merchant in this the merchant is a spellcaster of the paladins group. You could barter with her before you talk to the paladin. Alright. Alright, maybe we give it one more go. It would also be nice if I could get like all of us inside before the hubbub kicks off. Can where did they enter from? They entered from the side, right? From this side door? I think so. Let's see. Excuse me. Keep that beast away from us, you hear? Me, the beast. Now that's fucking rich. Hang on. Back, beast, back. Yeah. Okay, okay, but at least at this point we're all inside. Schmack her. Please, no more. Can't schmack. Leave us in peace and we shall leave you in kind. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please, we just want to go home. It says his posture, his eyes, is he telling the truth? We need another five or higher. God damn it. Nothing in his demeanor betrays him. But we know. Because we know. So there's no point going through this. Zarya? Certainly not. We serve Tyr, Lord of Justice, and no other. Please, mercy. Half of us are badly injured, the other half dead. I admit, we ambushed you. An assignment from our gods, Tyr. We thought you a devil, and with your flames you proved us right. But Tyr will not consign us to our death. He is merciful. Leave us, and we'll leave you. Enough! Enough! I'll not play pretend anymore. Karlak, we know. You're going home in pieces if needs must. And you. You'll soon learn what it means to ally yourself with the likes of this garbage. The furnace was never my home. It was my prison. I'm free now. And I'm never going back! How are you getting the first hit? Oh, because I'm first. Um, okay. Use your druid to cast entangle first. Yeah, but okay, hang on. Sometimes the only way out is through. Uh, thunder. No entangle memorized. Yeah, I don't have it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I can shoot down the brazier from the ceiling. 
Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. So this is my thinking right now, okay? Part of me is like, let's, let's, um, take care, not, not with my character. So like if I was to do Asterion first, have him take out this person, focus on taking out this person, and then will maybe also attacking this person. At least if I keep him back here, he's safe, right? Cause like, they can't get to him from in there unless they come further forward. This brazier is only over, it's only over this character here. So I could shoot that down and hopefully it would do, at least then it wouldn't miss and it would hit that person. I reckon, I don't know. I say we shut the door and forget all about the little brother's sword. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you put Karlak in melee range, if you put Karlak in melee range first, Asarian can sneak attack. Yeah, plus it'll create the fire surface, right? Okay. Okay, so I can, I can. All right. And luckily we all go bunched up together. So I can send in Karlak first to attack this person. Um, deals an extra one to two to five fire damage and sets your target on fire. It can take this damage every turn. It takes an action and a bonus action, which I think is fine. Or prevent, or do the, I don't, can I, I don't think, if I close the door, is it gonna use, yeah, also a good idea to keep Carl like in the choke to shrug off hits, right? What's the game difficulty level? It's uh, balanced, whatever the, the base, like the normal difficulty is. Okay, closing a door doesn't use an action. Okay. Poor me. Um, all right. If you want to use flame sword, use it before frenzy. Doesn't use action, just traps your druid. I know. Um, I know. I know. Uh, use it before frenzy. But I think this uses this and the bonus action, right? Yeah, that uses that and the bonus action. Okay, but I can end that turn. And then for Asterion's turn, sneak attack melee. Okay, great. So we've at least got one of them down. And then, and then, I think I might end his turn. I think I might end his turn. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what else I'd want him to do right now. I think he could stealth, like to, to hide. I know this thing. Okay. I don't think closing the door was the right move, if I'm being honest. Uh. Yeah. Um. Okay. Hang on. I could have him hide. But to hide him. You could use Will to open the door, Eldritch Blast the Brazier and back up. Okay, you can bring the Druid inside and close it behind her after you've taken your action. So here, can I do, can I do like Will? Will to open the door, Eldritch Blast that, and then 
But then would he have enough movement to come back inside or not, do you think? Yeah, he would. He would. Okay, so we'll just make short steps. Okay, open the door. All right. If I Eldritch Blast, can you Eldritch Blast this? Not enough movement. How close do you need to, how close do I need to be? Pull Druid back, Ice Knife one of them. No, I'm, I'll have my Druid shoot it and move it inside and then move inside. Let me, hang on. No, cancel, cancel. No, me? Nothing will stand in my way. Okay. Good lord. No time for mercy. Okay. And then I guess if I move inside here, then I've at least funneled them all into this choke, right? I'm thinking about that correctly. Yeah. Okay. One day I'll catch a break. And make Karlak run to the door. Uh, hang on. I feel like, okay, I might, now that I'm back inside, I might as well wild shape into the bear, right? And just give myself more, more, like a greater health pool. Because in theory, they should be wanting to approach me so I can melee them. Yeah, yeah, okay. We're cooking, guys, we're cooking. Okay, thanks for the follows, everyone. Um, does Will have an action? He should do. Fearless. Yes, he does. But I don't know what would be good right now. The one hit, the one hit by the brazier is concentrating on a spell which affects one of you. So hitting them has a chance to break their concentration and remove the spell. Uh, Will has an action. Could I get him to like Eldritch Blast her? Not enough movement. Oh no, I can. Might as well shatter. So hang on, cancel. Weakening strike, piercing strike, flirt. No, no, shatter, shatter. Shatter's better than Eldritch Blast, right? Shatter, also, yeah, Shatter, Shatter. Hey! Good lord, sorry. Uh, that's gotta be, that's 35. That's 55. So we should use the Eldritch Blast because it's got a higher percentage, right? Surely. More damage and hits both. Maybe it's worth risking it. We'll try it. Let my enemies fall. Nice. All right. Um. Is there anything I would want to do with this off ch off chance or not? I reckon I might end it here. Close the door. Close the door. Okay. <laughs> Reapply hacks. And I click on my, who do I, who, when I reapply the hex, sorry. I put it on the enemy. Okay, reapply the hex. No, 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 no. Cancel. Uh, can he jump back? Yeah, he could. I try get him behind my, my druid maybe. Yeah, let me do that. Okay, ha have him go there. Okay, okay. And then Karlak. Fire, baby. 
Oh, cancel. Cancel Carlac's end turn. I can just put Carlac closer to the door. Okay. I think I'm good to end everyone's turn. Okay. He can... Dip, jump, shove, dash, disengage. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think, okay, I'm gonna end my turns now, all right? This is my time. My turn. Hide is good for Asterion. There's blood in the earth. Cunning action, Just hide. Okay, I assume he's hidden. Bye forever, pal. Yep, all right. This is my happy place. I won't give in. Miss! <laughs> Miss twice! Um, okay. Carlax down. I know. I know. In, okay. Because Carlax is near that guy, can I use sneak attack to attack him? But then I'll be back where I am right now, right? Like, Asterion will assume back his position or not. I know, bless Karlak, bless her. A legend doesn't move back. So he would, okay, but I could then move him back myself, I guess, right? She isn't in melee with him anymore. Oh, so no sneak attacks, no move attacks, so she's down. Range should work. Range sneak attack. Shove can also be useful if he's near a ledge. Uh, okay, we can do sneak attack range. Must have advantage against targets. Click the ability hover and it'll tell you if it, yeah, so it's not gonna work. Should I maybe just help Karlak up since she's downed or does that not make sense? Have someone else raise Karlak, then try sneak attack. Oh, hang on. Uh, you can range sneak attack on Asterion. I think I tried that. I think I tried to do that and it said I must have advantage against target. So I assume that means I'm unable to, right? Welcome in, Justness, by the way. Pick up Karlak with Will, then sneak range with Asterion. All right, maybe. If you need breathing room, to move, you can try hitting an Eldritch Blast with Will since you took Repelling Blast. You could throw, because he's not, yeah, he's not hidden. You could throw healing potions at Karlak that will pick her up. How do I, how does that work? So, okay, I do, I click throw, I assume. And then I select what to throw. Throw, then select heal po Okay, okay. Throw. Potion of healing at Karlak. Can I even click her picture? I'll click her picture. Nice! A critical hit. Um, you did do it with Will, though. I fucked up. Uh... Uh Yeah, I fucked up. I fucked up. I did it as a starian. I fucked up. I fucked up. It's too late. Um Should I have him hide? Maybe maybe I put a starian further back. If I keep myself and Karlak within melee range, I can have I can have Asterion over here somewhere. And then he can do the sneak attacks. Thanks for the follows, guys. 
Oh shit, it's got a jump. Um Battle favors the fierce. Dude, this guy's so tanky! Hex E Blast for now. Hex M. Hex. I can't. I can't hex him. I can hex him. Okay. Hex. Just what to do. I don't know, bro. Put him up. Oh, she can't use reactions because she's dazed. So you were thinking I should jump behind the guy and basically position myself between these two and then use the goading roar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm basically sandwich myself between these two. It's a bold move. We'll see. What? Opportunity attack. I can't move the bear there. I can't reach it. Cause Carlax in the door. You clicked the wrong spot to jump. What do you mean? I literally said to put it between these two. Yeah, I clicked the right spot. Surely Carlax in the way. Yeah. Um. I'm thinking. Uh, I'm thinking. What do I want to do? I guess it's I've still got my bonus action available. It seems. So I can use that as the bonus action and then I'll use the raw still, I guess. I can't move past Karlak. Okay. Okay, okay. So sneak attack. Sneak attack with Asterion, I think makes sense. I'll get Karlak to close the door. First and foremost, Ice Knife, please be falls down. It's gold. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Can I do? Can oh, I do? It's go time. Just close the door. Okay. Let's have some fun. Ice Knife will hit them all. Oh, okay, okay. 
But I'm I'm correct in thinking range sneak attack? Why why the range sneak attack instead? What why sorry. The range do I want to use the ranged one so that Asterion stays out of range? Is that why? Or is it something else? Fuck it. Whatever. Oh, so he does not get to a star. Yeah, so he stays out of range. Okay, 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 okay. So hang on, hang on. Yeah, sneak attack range. Okay. Okay. Um. And I feel like. Flourish. Possibly throw your enemy off balance, offhand melee. I feel like I want to keep him at range still. So I might wrap up his turn, I guess. Do the offhand attack with him as well. And now this all provokes an attack of opportunity. I should. I know. I can't move. I can't move. I can't move. You're holding back. Eldritch blast. I'm at a disadvantage because I'm too close. So I'll move Will further back and then use it. So I'm just gonna like move him like here. Right? This makes sense to move him back and then use the Eldritch Blast. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Is this far enough back? Okay. Okay. He's got 11 left. Okay, he's got 11 left. Uh. Oh, so much for peace. Heal. Legacy of Kana burning hands. Each fumble target is hit. Oh no, but that might, I feel like that might have an AOE on for the rest of my, how can I tell? When you throw potions, you can heal two people. Okay, okay. And I can still, I still have movement on Will, so I can move Will further back if I want. I'm just trying to think of what do, what do I want myself to do? If you, ho oh, if you hover over it, it will show affected people. But like this one doesn't show anyone else affected, but Asterion would be affected. It'll, it'll show when I start the spell. I see, okay, so yeah, they would definitely get affected. They would also get affected. Um, they would also get affected. Okay. Um, hey, Beedalaroo. Thank you so much for using your prime here. Yeah, 18 months. Oh, shush, Beedalaroo. <laughs> um, you can aim at the ground, put AoE on the edge of him. For like this, for this one. I could, maybe if I put it there, but is it really worth, is Moonbeam AoE? Probably. You can move around with their radius without provoking opportunity attacks. You can angle Burning Hand to target only him. I think this is angled to target only him, right? It should be. Do we think this is smarter than just using the melee attack? Do we think? Yeah. We'll check Moonbeam. 
Calls down a beam of light that damages any creature that enters the beam or starts in its, t its turn in the light. You can use action to move the beam. But I feel like the beam is going to then screw over my teammates. I guess if I just keep it behind him like this. So we think Moonbeam over insanely effective. This deck save is likely worse than AC. Okay, so we're going to put the Moonbeam here. Okay, and it's only going to hit him. We all see it's only going to hit him. Okay, Carla, I have heal herself. And then I, we can just, I feel like I might just like end it here. You can get Will on high ground. What counts as high ground? Can I, can I? I don't think he can step on any of this stuff. There's a ladder. Yeah, but the ladder out the back, I don't have enough movement for that. And I don't think I can move on top of the barrel. Like this, maybe? I right click the box and it'll say climb. Climb on. Okay. Oh my god. Help me! Okay. No! Bastards! I'm zoomed all the way in. This is literally me zoomed all the way in. Just end his turn! I feel like I'm being so astoundingly trolled but then isn't that gonna just do the same shit whenever i try and click into will okay okay wait but astarian i should have moved further back right i think i'm i'm correct in thinking astarian for further back will be safe yeah because he has ranged attacks and what have you let's move him back let's move him back like how far can I move? Like here, I guess? Or actually... We'll do like here. Okay, okay. And then myself. Time to push my luck again. M myself back here. And then... Harlak. Karlak back, back like here maybe? Yeah, yeah, not walking into Moonbeam. She's not gonna walk into the Moonbeam this way, right? That would be crazy if she does that. Surely, use short steps. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna end turn here. Never underestimate how dumb I can be. It's actually a really hard fight. It's level three. You're doing well. Thank you, Fred Word and everyone. Don't get AOE'd. Okay, well this is as far back as I can move her. Okay. The dance macabre. We're ending turns, guys. On the victor's path. They're breathing, despite everything. Huh? They didn't open the door. She stayed hidden. Can I just end my turn for everyone? And that'll force her hand out, right? Like there's no reason for me to, there's no reason for me to, to do anything right now. Move the, oh, move the beam in the doorway. Okay. Nothing important is ever easy. How do I... How do I... 
Oh, here, here. Move the moonbeam. Damn! In the doorway like this? I can really do this? Okay, but now I'm definitely ending my turns. Because I'm not opening that door. Moonbeam OP, getting good. Okay, okay. More oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, Karlak. Heating up. Karlak heal. Karlak heal. Karlak heal. Oh no, I don't think we have any potions. I'm out of potions. Potion? No. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. So I'm ending. No Shadow Hot. I don't have Shadow Hot with me. Okay, I'm ending all my turns now. Let's turn someone inside out. I don't think I can. Can Holding I move it? Well, I can't move it again because I've already moved it once. So we'll. we'll, we'll I'm going to end the turns. Battle favors the fearless. This is going to feel good. What the f Where do I go from here? Not enough movement. Hey, what the fuck? She's waiting for me, bro. You may have to open the door. She forgot about you. Do you think I have to open the door? Yeah, I can't move it where I can't see it. Um. Okay, okay. Yeah, opening door would get hit by the moon moon. Don't walk into the moon moon. Okay. I think we're gonna do this. I'd go around to the other door. Yeah, I think I might move the beam. Is this particular door destructible? I think it is, Horda. Oh, I can shoot the door down. Ah, maybe I shoot the door down. Hopam. No, it's such a big door. Use Eldritch Blast on it. Okay, okay. No holding back. Okay, hang on, hang on. I've missed this. Have you? <laughs> okay. Uh now I could just end all of my turns, I guess, right? And wait for her play. Still can't move. Now move the beam, moon beam. I don't think Still I can. It's not. Oh no, I already used my action for this turn. Okay, okay. Asterion. Hide. The subtle approach. Where do I want him to hide to? Just like around here? Cause you're not, he's not, you, where, where would you want me to hide him to? Sure. Near the door. Like on the other end of the door? To see into the room? To peek the door. He's, I, I'm, I, I won't, I'm ignoring. I, I, think, I feel like you guys are overcomplicating this. Cancel. C cancel. Let's let's just see what she does this time. Let let's just try. Let's just try. What now? Fuck yes. This is so astoundingly agitating. Oh, 
station. No! Okay, well, I'll just have me move, like, here. The blade will not bend. Uh, okay, I can have me like move down here. Have me move here. You're such a stupid bitch, Will. That shit is so annoying. If she doesn't move the moonbeam, we'll kill her. That's a fair point. But you just don't... Like, Will just being Will. You had one... You had one fucking thing to do, dude. I'm moving back, I'm moving back. I end I'll end my turns. Forever dauntless. <laughs> Fuck them. Fuck Thoriel. I won't go back. I'm never going back. And if any of Mummy's little friends want to pick up where the others left off, they'll find nothing but a pile of ash. We did it! <laughs> um, thank you. Definitely first try. I will say though, for, okay, when we did the when we did the fight the first go around, I was like, holy shit, I'm nowhere near going to be able to do this. And so it was good to do the fight around the other way. We had a better angle of attack. I also feel like I'm starting to learn like some of the attacks better. I'm actually really glad I got to use the moonbeam because it feels very in tune with my character since we are a moon druid. Uh, and you guys helped teach a lot. So thank you so much. And I did it at level three. So thank you guys. <laughs> 500 playthrough, let's go. Moonbeam's great, I'm loving it. So thank you guys all for chiming in and for being patient. Chat made that so complicated, but it also made it very helpful. I, I, I definitely couldn't have done a bunch of that stuff without your guys' help and information. So thank you guys for being here and being patient. Thank you guys. Easy car. Like those frames are getting hot. Zariel won't get near you again. We'll make sure of that. I feel like that's a much nicer thing to say. Like, let her be passionate right now. That's right, she won't. She can't. She couldn't even lay a finger. <laughs> Good lord. Oh, Karlak is sprinting in there, I think. Okay, oh. Fuck you. That's awesome. That's awesome that they have her do this. Good lord. I mean, good lord. It's incredible. She is going berserk mode. I just want to follow. I just want to zoom about and follow her. Just blowing off some steam. I wonder if she'll st- Because she's also- Guys, hang on. Actually, call out. Call out. Call out. Stop. Stop. Stop it. Hang on, save. That ought to do it. You've now made this place all fiery. We can't walk around it, you dozy doddy. Whew. Had to let off a little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted, the fire's lasting a little longer than it should. How do I look? Stunning. Like, you should have melted a long time. <laughs> Slightly mad. Are you all right? We're not going to say that. Like, you should have melted a long time ago. How can you stand it? Honey, I could go all night. 
No wonder people thirst for that. her. Infernal engine for a heart. Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close till I've found a way to calm it down. How the hell did you get an infernal engine for a heart? High pain tolerance and a dynamic duo of truly shitty bosses. But it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the scar show for later, after we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things, if I can find him. There are some tieflings holed up in a druid grove nearby. We might look there. Sounds like a good lead. Hopefully our guy will be among them. A tune-up would do this old tub a world of good. This old tub a world of good. Okay. Well, mercifully, the fire has gone out. So let's definitely loot these people. We've got better armor, I reckon. Um, let's have a look. I suspect to have a great night's sleep. Thank you so much. Um, can you save? Can you save? That sword is good on Karlak. All right. I actually think we're also going to pause here for today.